folks, Andy and Aid here from Wargamer Fun. Welcome back. It's been a really long time, we're aware. But you'll see from the other cameras that we've got going on, Aid has spent a lot of time making sure that the we've YouTubed ourselves, yeah. is what we've done. We've made it look a little bit more like a YouTube studio. It's not. It's still the same place. We're still it's playing in his garage, but it looks great. We've got the place set up the way that we want, the way that Aid has made it. So he's happy now with the layout that we've got and we're back and for the very first time in 10 years in 10 years it's been we're back playing warhammer the old world not fantasy battles yeah. but the next best thing warhammer fantasy battles is dead and gone it's never coming back but the old world is here so in our inaugural game of um, the old world We've gone back to what was probably our final game, for me anyway, yeah. is I'm going to play some Ogres. Uh, my Ogres um, are all, because they're a legacy army and Games Workshop doesn't necessarily care about them, um, mine are 3D printed and they're in a pirate theme from Titan Forge miniatures. Those are the, all, all of these models are from Titan Forge miniatures, all oh, apart from the Butcher. I'll get to him in a minute. And I've printed them out on my 3D printer, uh, started getting them all painted, but they're all based around this theme of. Um, pirates so in my list we're playing a 1250 point game and it's the game the mission is break point um which is a quarter of your army's strength unit strength yeah you break out so for me i've got i think we calculated it my break point is 11 so once i get to unit strength of 11 my army breaks and i lose um and then aids is 20 and he loses but he'll take you through his in a minute in my list i've got three ogre balls full command in there um but nothing else they are naked other than that they've got iron fists for this game because an iron fist nowadays is brilliant i've got a unit of three um ogre man eaters two of them have got um iron fists one with a great weapon all with brace of ogre pistols and the banner of something I cool. I just noticed he's an undead one. He's an he? undead one, yes. He's an undead guy. Um, they've got the cannibal totem. So uh, they've got regen five, but they only roll one dice to chase. No other items other than that in them. Um, I've gone for a bit of a hungry hippo theme. Points for anybody that can remember off the top of your head what the four colours of the original hungry hippos were. All right, in the comments below, please. Um, yes. They've got bonus points if you can remember names. As if well. you can remember the names, which I didn't even know they had until I started doing a little bit of research. That's right, I researched hungry hippos. They actually had names as well, the four hippos of the apocalypse. Um, these guys have also got a banner. Their banner is the something banner. I'll tell you later on. I can't remember what it is. Um, I've got a unit of Iron Guts. The Iron Guts have got the Dragon Hide banner, re-rolling ones to hit, and flaming attacks. Great weapons. Full command group in there as well. And then... Deep Sea Divers. Yeah, Deep Sea Divers, which, again, I didn't think I liked them originally, but then I looked at them when I printed them and realised I loved them more than yeah. really I should. Um, and then finally, I've got a level four slaughter master at the back with with butcher's cauldron. He's also got some magic items, um, but again, I can't remember what I've given him. He's got the more seeker big name. I forgot big names for the ogres. Uh, so he's got more seeker, which makes him plus one toughness, but it also makes him stupid. Which oh, okay. I'd forgotten about because if I put him in a unit and he's stupid, he's not stupid because it has to be majority of the unit that's stupid. But if he's on his own, he's stupid. I forgot about that. Okay, he'll be fine. So, uh, stupid ogre uh, slaughtermaster. Uh, he's taken the law of battle and he's got pillar of fire, arcane urgency, curse of cowardly flight. And then I dropped one of my spells for toothcracker because I think it's an amazingly good spell. That's what they've got. They've got the banner. Uh, they've got the banner of um, five plus regeneration. They've got five oh, okay. regen banner on them. I can't, it's an ogre specific one. Up against night goblins. Yes. You can see proper night goblins. The back of the night them. goblins. He's painted them gloriously as well. So, That's amazing. Mango squid on the far, my far left. Yep. Um, and his far right. Then we've got the first of a unit of squig hoppers. Normal giant. Another unit of squig hoppers. The only upgrade the uh, squig hoppers have is the um, 
champion. Mm. Yeah, sergeant, champion, yeah. whatever they're called. Two units of night goblins, both armed with nets, a standard bearer, and a champion. No other upgrades in there. This one has a level um, four wizard who has got the war. I'll read the spells in a bit. This one, sorry, Andy, he should be in there. Oh, so yeah, you, why would you put two champions in one unit? Yeah. Two heroes in one, in one unit. You wouldn't. Um, so if you want to go in. So a standard goblin hero, uh, level four, night goblin. Wizard. Wizard, yeah. I may have said Shaman, goblin. Shaman, they're called shamans. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I may have said goblin for him, but he's not. He's a night goblin. Yeah. And another hero level champion. I forget what they're called. Boss. Night goblin bosses, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, you've got there's big bosses boss, and yeah, bosses. Yeah, yeah, more bosses. Or so, big boss and yeah, and boss. He's he's the one down and he's riding a mangler squig. Main upgrade for him is the Ruby Ring of Ruin and the wall, the Wallops one hit wonder or something <laughs> like that. His first attack is at strength ten or something Outstanding like that. Standing news. I um, love it. That's great. Uh, but other than that, it's it's fairly light. I mean, there's a lot of models there. That said, each of these it's no surprise Andy knows. Yeah. Um, there are three, three fanatics in each three one. fanatics in each unit because Night Goblins is all about the fanatics. Why would you take Night Goblins if you didn't have fanatics? Yeah. So and Andy knows that because he can see I've got six out and there's two units. There yeah, if we were going to a tournament, Aid would have kept them in his yeah. bag because he doesn't have to declare them because they're hidden deployment. Yeah. But we're not here for that. We're just here yeah. to roll some dice and have a good time. Yeah. So I've put fireball for him. The signature spell, I put a face down card to remind me I've got the signature spell for him is the Itchy Nuisance from the Law of Mork. Which is minus D3 toughness. Yeah. Then I've got Hand of Mork, Bad Moon Rising, and Evil Suns Shining as their spells. Yes. I was lucky enough to get a magic set of cards. Yes, he was. Whereas Andy got a better deal by buying them off uh, Etsy. I bought them off Etsy and got every single one. Yes. I got them all, and they are beautiful. I mean, look yeah, at, they've look they've at the artwork. Yeah. That's Absolutely insane. Uh, we'll put a link oh, yeah. in the description we'll get the, below. We'll get the link. However, nobody will buy them because they're really, really, really expensive. Well, they were. Yes and no. But you can't get the other ones anywhere yeah. at all. So if, if you want them, it's the only way to get them. The only way to get them. And we've they seen. are beautiful. They are beautiful as well. They look great. And our mate Matt did an amazing job. Put them all in sleeves and in a box for me as well. Yeah, so. all those books he got for you as well. Oh, yeah. And he got the army books for me as well, which... I don't know where my ogre one is. He hasn't given it to me yet. That's why I haven't got it. I haven't received it. And, That's why I brought and it. And that will be showing up here soon, hopefully, yeah. anyway. Yeah, hopefully he'll be coming along to play with some zombie madness. Yeah, absolutely yeah. right. So, I hope you enjoy the game. There may be mistakes because we're new. Again. Ish. We've played probably 10, 20 yeah, games. 10 or, not 20, nowhere near. Maybe 10 games. Yeah. However, we're going to go back in time to when we played Warhammer Fantasy Battles. Yeah. If we do something wrong, tell us. Page numbers, not opinions, kids. All right. Yeah. We've only got one rule book and a FAQ, but the FAQ is about two pages long. So if we do anything wrong, please let us know, but tell us where you know that information from, not your opinion, please. Yeah, it, it will help us get better. Yeah, only for our help. Yeah. Yeah. All places of love, kids. Yeah. All places of love. It may come up. We've done a house ruling on the um, fanatics. Yes. The two possible opinions. Uh, and it basically comes around that, if you roll that on the random movement. Some people say that you should go in the arrow. Others say that you spin on the spot. Maybe you'd like to state your opinion yeah. below. And maybe you'd like to find a page number for it as yeah. well. That would be brilliant. That but would be. We couldn't find the answer anywhere. Correct. So we rolled a dice and we're playing spin on the spot. They spin you know? on the spot. So they don't move. If aid rolls a hit, and let. So the only thing that does happen is if they roll a double, they die. Yeah. If aid rolls that and a double, they still die. Yes. All right. They get ca caught up in their own uh, mangler and they die. So yeah. that's it. But that, for us, they're just going to spin in place. We figure. There's as many good things that happen from him being in place yeah. from my perspective as there are for him. And yeah. it's a one in six chance that that one... So one of those goblins every turn, as long as they don't die before, and yeah. we'll roll that. Okay, Aid can't predict that. I can't predict it. It's random enough that it doesn't benefit me or him. Yeah, it, it just seemed the fairest system. Yeah, the fairest way chat about yeah. it. Yeah, we had a chat about it. Yeah, of course. And that's so, how you should do it, kids. Yeah. Enjoy yourselves while playing games. It's not hard. Yeah. Seriously. And if you're going to criticise us for painting, feel free. Feel free. Feel free. Because, look, I have got paint on 
every model. Oh, no, apart from those. Either. Oh, no, I have. I've got paint on every model. Okay. Shut up. We'll get there one day. I am, I'm working my way through it. We're enjoying it. All yeah. right, we're enjoying the hobby again. It's been a while since we've got to play really, really big rank and flank games. So we're building up to the 2,000 point dream yeah. that we used to play at, but we're very slow at the moment. So <laughs> bear with us. All right. Hope you're enjoying. Thanks very much. Off for first turn. I'm getting a plus one. I'm going to roll it in the pot because that's what it's for. You're right. Oh, it's a I draw. will re-roll. No, it's a draw. Bollocks. No, <laughs> you you are getting. So I have to. You first. have to have the first turn. That's right. Well, best off we go. Living the dream. So no charges. No. Um, anything first? Spells, hexes, and enchantments. Enchantment. That's when I do this now. And yes. hexes. Hexes, fifteen inch range. So there's no so range no. on that. Magic missile, 24 inch range. That's in the shooting phase, not in the movement phase. I'm just checking the thing. We must be within that sort of range, right? I think. Yeah, well, in this scenario, it's nine inches in the middle, isn't it? 18 in it. So, if we're. But I, do, I was a bit cowardly. Yeah. As... <laughs> well, yeah, you might not have control of that, though, because you're on squigs. So, effects until the start of your next turn, friendly units that are within the caster's command range may re roll any to hit of a natural one when improve armor <gasps> piercing by one. Amazing. That's so, amazing. It casts on a nine. This guy's going to do it. I don't think I gave him the staff in the end, but I will check. Uh, for those of you that care about my stuff, I gave my, my uh, wizard the Demon Slayer Scars, the Halfling Cookbook, which I need to pick a spell for. Um, he's got the Blood Clo Cleaver. He is more Seeker, and he knows battle magic. Right. I need a D3. The Staff of Badoom. Badoom. <laughs> I <laughs> love it. The Staff of Badoom. When he casts a spell, he rolls a D3 at the same time. Okay. Uh, the bearer of the Staff of Badoom applies a D3 modifier to the result of any casting roll they make. However, if they roll a natural double one or double six, when making the casting roll a cent center of five-inch template over the bearer, every model, friend or foe, that lies beneath it suffers a strength six hit hit with an AP of one. <laughs> the staff is destroyed. It cannot be used again. So my guy, just so you're aware, I've got the Halfling Cookbook, which increases my command range. <laughs> halfling yeah, Cookbook. Halfling Cookbook. It's literally how to cook halflings. Um, <laughs> I was going to say, halflings know how to cook. <laughs> they know how to cook. No, no, ogres know how to cook halflings. So um, his command range, his dispel range, and the range of a single spell chosen by the controlling player, not including range self spells, is increased by three inches. Okay. So he can dispel from 27 inches away. Okay. So here we go. It's casting itself. Needs a nine. Go for it. Five, six, seven. seven. No, four. Oh, sorry, seven. Seven. That's Plus four. Three. He's 11. He's 11. Now... I'm going to check. I don't know, because we don't have to be that far away from each other, but I don't know whether or not... No. This guy. Oh, is that guy? Oh, oh no, sorry. Is that him. guy in there? This That's one. 27 inches there. So I'm out of range. I may as well try and roll an 11, though, on the old um, fated dispel. I need a 12. Okay. Four, seven... I've done 11. Ten, yeah. yeah, 11. Do I need a double six? No, don't get it. Doesn't happen, aid. So, so until the start of your next turn, or is it remains in play? That goes on him. Uh, until the start of your next turn subphase. Cool. Okay. Bad Moon Rising is a hex, but there's no one in range. Conveyance, that's in the movement. Yeah. And Fireballs in the shooting. Cool. Itchy Nuisance is a hex, which would be now. But, but he's not no in range. range. Because Itchy Nuisance has to be more. It can't be 27 inches. 15 inches. Oh, 15. It's still quite a long range. Okay. So, movement on this fellow. Yes. 12 inches. 12 inches. Go on! I have to move it. Yes, you do, inches. yeah. You sure do, sir. Oh, this is going to be painful. Can I... <laughs> mind you, it doesn't matter which way I go, does it? Not really. I could turn him and go this way. Oh, because they get to pivot first, yeah. don't they? And then in a straight line. I think I'm going to have to. Does it take any of his movement, or do you just bounce in random directions? I think you turn him and move him. Okay. I okay. Need, need to check it, really, don't Sure. I? 3d6. Oh. Giant cave squig. Exactly <laughs> what he is, isn't it? <laughs> yep. Jeez, he may have to go that way because he might be off the table. 14 inches. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It just says random movement. 176, aid. I mean, I've got it here, but... Okay, so... Special do not have normal movement. Uh, with those special rules. Roll the dice to determine how far it must move. Modern special rule move during the compulsory move subphase. They can wheel to change direction, but cannot perform any other manoeuvre. If the model is able to make contact with an enemy compulsory... It may do so. 
counts as having charged. Oh, so you said wheel, didn't you? Not pivot. Correct. It may wheel. So, so that wheel, means it wheel takes... to change direction. Yes. So that would come out of the 40s. Correct. So what I might do then is if I pivot that corner. Yep. Wheel in for two. Yep. And then and then 12 inches over there. Without hitting. I don't think he's hitting them, Andy. Agree. Totally uh, agree, Aid. Totally agree. So he sets off the fanatics and out they come. He's Stop. not going to do that. Oh, okay. Sorry. That's all right. He's just going to do. Come get some. He's going to set fire to my ogres. That's what he's going to do. But outrageous. Love it. Love it more than I can tell you, Aid. Um, I'll do movement for them. I think they're 2d6. Oh, okay. They can't be as fast as the... Uh... As the giant cave squig. Squig. Well, it might be because it's 2d6 on a thing, isn't it? Goblin, spider, no. They have a lot of units. Yes, they do. Squig herders, 3d6. They are 3d6. Hoppers, these ones, not herders, though. Hoppers. Hoppers. So, 3d6. Go on, lads, let's go. Straight to the trees. Uh, see, that's more... Oh. It should be 10, shouldn't it? Yeah, it should be so, 10. 8. 8. So what they will do, boing, they will wheel for 3, and then forward 5. Cool. Boing. I'll do these guys now. Yep. 11. 11. It probably made up the other average, hasn't it, there? Oh, this is going to be so painful. <laughs> <laughs> so far. How far does the mangler squid go? Like, is he 3D6? He, oh, he's got to be. He can't be more. He can't be more, surely, to God. He'd be unwieldy. Mango Squig, 3D6. 3D6 as well. Okay, cool. The, these would be great rolls if you'd gone first. Yes. Cool. Yep. Yep. Ah, oh, there you go. Eight. Eight. Not terrible. Right. The giant, he can move six. Six. He could march 12, couldn't he? Yes. I think the giant's going to be busy this side, getting beaten up by... So five, two... There. Less than 12. Yeah, for pivot. sure, mate. Yeah, for sure. Um, these guys, I'm pretty sure... You can pivot true. as many as you like, as many times as you like, Aid. On a march? In a march. Oh. You just can only pivot once during a charge. Wheel as many times as you like, even. Night goblins. Speed four. Got to be... Or maybe five, actually, for goblins. You reckon they're faster than a human? Okay. Night goblin mob, speed four. Good call. Oh. So I'll go forward an inch, maybe two, and then that leaves... Ooh, I'm a marching. He's going to die. I won't march, because if I march, I can't cast any spells. That is valid. Not that he has spells, but... Well, yeah, he hasn't got any. So you can, if you want to march, you'll march, mate. It doesn't matter. If he marches, Sorry. he can't cast spells, then. That's it. I'd... In case you yeah. care. So, that's the movement. You release your fanatics in the command subphase. I'm sure you do. Oh, do you? Okay, okay. Be in Night Goblin mobs. And is that in my command phase as well? You can release me in Either. my command phase as well. Okay, but it's... You either release me in my command yeah. phase or not at all. Fanatics are not placed on the battlefield at the start of the game. Instead, make a note of which units. Yeah. Uh, when a fanatic is released... Oh, sorry. Right. A concealing unit may release one or more of its fanatics during any start of turn subphase. Okay. And so mine and yours. Cool. Um, but there's no point in releasing them turn one. Well, not so, for you anyway. So they're moved. You might want to do them in mine, but you might not. Okay. Fireball. Fireball! This guy's going to try fireball. Yep. Onto the butchers. Yep. Not the butchers. Yeah, they the, are butchers. The bulls. Bulls. They are bulls. So it's 2 d 6 plus two. 3. Yep. So that's an 8. 11. Plus 2 because of the ten. ring. 10. Gives me 10. Cast no, on an 8. 3. Plus 3. It's 11. It's bone spell power level 3 is the ring, is it not? I think it's a 2. Oh, I thought, I, it, was, I thought it was 3. It, um, well, it, it's gone off. Yes. We can but, look it up if it matters. But it might it might not matter. Let me have a look at how far away my my butcher is. That's twenty seven inches there, aid. Yeah. Okay, okay, budget. Get back on the horse. So it may matter, it may not. At the moment it's on a ten or eleven. Yes, ten or an eleven. Uh, Six and four is a ten. Ten. So either way it still goes off, doesn't it? Because you have to beat it. I have to beat it, yes, you're right. Four, six, ten, you're right, it goes off. Yeah, you're right, you're absolutely right, Ed. So two D six, seven, perfectly average. Strength four hits. Uh, six, seven. Strength four toughness four. So four. Four wound. Perfect. That There's no armor piercing on it. So that's four. Flaming attacks. So that doesn't matter to me. Uh, so that is uh, light armor and um, iron fists. Yep. It's a five of bomb save. Make one. An ogre dies. That is a morale check. In a minute. At the yeah. end of the shooting phase. Um, the other, right. Assailment in combat. Conveyance. Range of 18 inches. This spell can only target friendly characters, but may target characters engaged in combat. You may immediately remove the target 
for any character and place him anywhere within 2d6. I'm hoping I can get him out of... We need to get him to leave. Yes. So I need the d3 as well. So cast on a seven. Yes. My intention is for the wizard to cast it on yep. him. Cool. That's nine, 10, 11, 15. 15. I don't know if you're in range because I have oh, moved, yes. I right. have moved him. Moved 27, you Yeah, 27, please, yeah. That's the edge of his base. Nope, he's not in range anyway, though, so it happens. So I move him 2d6 now, don't I? Yes. Seven. Nice, perfect average. Is there any restrictions? No, he's just literally removed and placed within 2d6 inches, right? Yeah, no double one. Double one means he loses a wound because he lands badly. So 2d6 is seven, so I can move him back seven inches. Yeah. Back to back, I did. Yeah. I did do back to back, didn't I? <gasps> Wait, you can't... Is not is that conveyance aid? Yes. You can't, can you, you can't do that then, can you? Because that conveyance spells <gasps> is movement phase, isn't it? But this is the movement phase? No, it's shooting phase. Sorry, Andy. I should have moved him before. You, could, you couldn't have moved him then shot, could you? you, you I could probably do could have. We'll do it then. Because of the range. Do it then. I don't care. I'll do it. It's you fine. Sure? Yeah, absolutely. 100%. Sorry, guys. So, no, sorry. I've I've just... Uh, so, no. You, yeah, so... Well, He's within 24 inches. Yeah, 24 inches. It's fine. Um, Sorry, guys. It's all right. Roll if if you're going to get... If you're going to get upset about us making little mistakes like that, which we've then called... Not really a down. little mistake. Oh, it is, because it wouldn't well, have made that much of a difference, would essentially, it? Essentially, I cast the spells the wrong way around. Yes, exactly that. Nothing else has changed other than No, that, the game state it. doesn't change. I'm just checking. I'm just thinking, has that made a massive difference? No. It's just those two spells the wrong That's way around. That's all it around, is. I was just checking, is Ruby Ring of Ruin the same as um, Fireball? Okay. That's, I... that's the only thing that I'm thinking, Aid. And I can't remember where the magic items are. Right, gave you Ruby Ring of Ruin. Oh, it's in. It's not in the thing, is it? It's in the... No, it, it's in the... Right, the Wilder of the Ruby Ring of Ruin can cast the Fireball spell. Oh, sweet. So, yes, it can. Uh, from the Law of Battle Magic as a bounce spell with a power level of two. Oh, it's two, so it is on a ten. Fine, you were right. It's there. Okay. But so, that's great. So, so okay. literally, nothing changes All other I than... Did. Was the other way around. Okay. Fine, no problem. Uh, right, so is that the end of the? Sh- that's the only shooting then. I have Any no more shooting? shooting? I have no shooting. Well, that fireball is a shooting attack. Other than yeah, so I'll take a morale check on the bulls then, because they a panic check. Sorry, on the bulls, they pass on a nine. It's fine. Are they leadership nine? No, oh, I do it under the leadership donor, not over it. Oh god, I thought I was going. No, you're right. They fail. So they flee. Do they fall back in good order. Do they flee. They're, they're not at below 50%, are they? No. So they fall so back. So they fall back, back and then they ra- they automatically rally. Is yes. that right? Yes, they auto rally. So it's. I'm saying yes with absolute certainty. So that's six inches. They fall back and it automatically rallies at the end of its flea move. So I go as far as I possibly could, which is six inches because I rolled a six. And then turns around. And then comes back again. So I'll just do it six inches aid. Bloop. I'm already leaving books on the table. I'm desperately trying not to. Naughty, 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 yes. There you go. Professionals here. We're professionals, honest. To goodness. There we go. And then they automatically rally, so they're back again. Sorry about getting those two spells no, the wrong way around. It doesn't matter. Uh, the, the other one I've got is a hex, um, which is at the beginning of the turn, isn't it? Not now. And that one is conveyance, which I've just done. All right. So that's the end of my turn one. Your turn one, now. My turn one. Charges. Desperately, desperately want to charge stuff. So all I want, how far away is that big fella? Don't want. Get in there. <gasps> so that is more than 16, so it's 17. So I'd need a 10, is what we're saying there. Who's charging, sorry? Yeah. Is that Still recording? That's the memory full. <laughs> oh no, this is going to be right for 10 minutes. I'm just wondering, because I don't even know what speed the Mornfang are. I'm saying that they're seven, but I don't know that they are. Sounds about right, though. It sounds it, but we should. I should probably check. So, no, the Mornfanger speed eight. So you need a nine. So I'd need a nine. Are they swift stride? Yes. Good chance you'll get it. I, I, I'm saying, of course they are. Yes, they are. They are swift stride. Well, why not? I'll give it a bash, eh? So they're going to charge them. He's immune to psychology. Yep. He can't flee. So he can't flee. They are going to charge them. Okay. Also immune to psychology, can't flee. Yep. Oh, before I do any of that, I have to take a leadership check for him. Yeah. He's stupid. He's not. On a four, he's okay. It's a good job, to be honest with you, because I feel like I might need this. Right, there you go. So, they're my only charges for the turn, and you can't respond to so it. That's it, right? So, Mornfan Cav. It's looking good so far. I've rolled a six and a one, so I'll keep the six. 
So I need a two plus. I've said this many times before. I've just rolled on one. You, um, they moved nine, you said? No, they moved eight. Eight. And it was 17, so you need a nine, so you need a three. I need a three, sorry. I need a three. Yeah. Okay. Three plus. Hooray. Oh, blum, blum. Go, boys. Whee. Uh, I, I can go within an inch of them, can't I? On a charge, yeah. On a charge, yeah. Bonk. Actually, if I do that, bonky bonk. Yeah, you, you're going to hit him. Oh, right God. Here. Right, I'm going to do that. That's maximised, right? That's two of my guys in combat with your guy. And before you take your guy off when I kill him, we'll, uh, I'll, I'll line mine up to where your guys are. It's just because the hippos are giants. Yeah, if I turn him round, he's got a spike on his head, that's what's stopping him. Oh, if is I, it? If what? I turn him round, you've got the chain, so... <laughs> so, if I... Put one of those to show the back of oh, mine. Oh, yeah, good idea. Yeah, or the front even. The front of yours, yeah. Oh, lovely work. You could actually put that onto the corner of his base. No? I could, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then we do it from the inside corner. That makes sense. Right, then. Yes. Happened. Now I was going to say, can they fit? But I'm sure you could. What do you mean? If they could fit through that gap. but they Oh, can. these guys, so yes. I'm looking at the tray, not the, right. the models. Um, then that's... Oh, no, it's closest to closest, right? It doesn't... No, it doesn't matter. It's, if I do the furthest... To where he has to go. That's why... I, oh, God. Well, this ain't going to work out, Aid. You don't know yet. Well, they're not Swift Stride, are they? No, they're not. And um, it's... I, I should. I probably should have measured this. It might be that... I don't know. No, 6 and 6 is 12. The, the furthest they can go is 12. 12 inches. So I can't... But the closest to closest might be within 12. OK, let's find out. That's my guy there, Aid. No. He's no even... So I can't declare that charge, can I? I'm so, not actually allowed. But is that right? That's right. But right. you haven't... We haven't done it yet, have we? Cool. I'll just edit that out. Yeah, okay. Well, you can't edit out the fucking, the, the, the me declaring of charges now. I can. I oh. won't. But okay. <laughs> I'll forget. I'll, you'll probably declare the charge and I'll edit out this bit. <laughs> be more what happened? Right, so then that's all that I'm going to do for them. Then that's it. Oh, God. Well, it's either they charge into them in the flank. Yeah, well, there's, there's bugger all I can do. Oh, I don't can know. march them. I could march them, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to walk them six inches. They're going to go to there, like that. The um, the ogre, the the slaughtermaster, is going to go an inch. I'll piss it. He's not going to go an inch that way. He's going to go the other way, Aid. He's going to go an inch, and then four more. I haven't done any spells. I've done no spells. No, but you can do them. No because spells. you haven't moved him, and Ish. we know the others. So do your spells now. Okay, right. I'm going to try and put um, tooth cracker. Onto the, onto the, he was stood in between the you two could units. See them. Well, you could yeah. see them both. So he's going to try and put Toothcracker on the, on the, 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 the what are they called? Monfang. Monfang. Thanks, eh? Cheers. Cheers. Monfang I'm those. going to go on, I'm going to do it on a 10. I'm going to try and do it on a 10 plus. I'm still not sure if you have, can you answer that if you know? Oh, if you can, that'd be amazing. Here's the question on this sheet, on this card, it's got a seven and a 10. Is that you have to pick the level that you're casting it at, or if you get a seven, you get it at plus one. If you get a ten plus, it goes up plus two. Or do you have to pick the level before yeah. you roll? Yeah. I think I think it's you, you pick the level, then you roll. Not I you haven't just get read it. that anywhere. No, that's the thing. And I'm wondering if we're bringing that. Bringing that from, yeah, you could be right because it just says if this spell is cast with a casting roll of seven or more. The target friendly rat unit gains plus one. Doesn't if the spell is there. cast, it doesn't say that I have to pick. It doesn't mention anywhere. Maybe I'm there. getting that wrong. I, I can see where you're coming from. Yeah. But I don't think you do. I think you roll and see what you get. All right. I'll, I'll, we'll go with that. I'm all right with it because I think otherwise you're likely to fail this spell. So well, maybe you would never risk it. I don't know. So I've rolled a seven. Seven and four is 11. So that goes off. Yeah, I could try with a twelve. Well, I'm out of range with him. Yes, indeed. But I, because I can, why you not? might as not. You might as well do it. We're halfway Ooh. there, kids. I saw the six. Me too. And I thought, oh no, right. So they are at plus two toughness now. Ooh, until the end of this turn. Absolute irrelevance. That is. That's. I've. I've cast that spell. I thought it was going to be great, and it ain't. Right. Your guys oh. cause fear, don't they? Oh yeah. 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 I'm. Pretty sure. You mean psychology? It's irrelevant. No, mine oh, causes just, terror. I think. Just terror. But I don't think you do a terror check. I don't do a terror <laughs> check unless you charge me, and I won't take fear because my unit strength is six and yours is only four. Yeah, okay. I think. I'm, I'm just checking if he does because he might not cause terror. I'd be quite concerned if 
the Mangle Squig, which I know it's an old model now, but it is a beautiful model. Oh, it's a great miniature. I think it's, I think it's a fantastic, um, arguably one of my favourite models in the game. Special rules, immune psychology, impact hits, which you've got rid of, large target, random attacks, random movement, spike ball and chain, stomp attack, timber. Oh, when it falls uh, it dies, cool. D- ooh, none of it says terror. So no terror. Behemoth, okay. colossal <laughs> fanged gob, yeah. see below, and scaly skin. Cool. Unless all behemoths cause terror, but it doesn't I say do that. I do not think they do, mate. It doesn't say it for the Arachnorok either, and I find it hard to believe that the Arachnorok doesn't cause terror. I know. But That's valid. Giants does have terror there. Oh, okay. So it does state it. Does, it does state it. So Arachnorok spider doesn't cause terror. It's literally more people are afraid of spiders than everything else, anything else in the world, yeah. and this is one that's bigger than a building. Yeah. I can't see it there. So. Okay. Right. I'm then going to try... Oh, hang on. What? That's a, is that a hex? I'm doing it now. That's a hex. So, so now you'd move him. No, so I've got a hex first, which but, is the, oh yeah, the curse of cowardly flight. He is a the the big guy's a large target, right? I'll cast the curse of cowardly flight on him. I'm going to check and see whether or not I can. Giants, they're immune. They're unbreakable. Does unbreakable mean they don't check? Correct. It does. Because he's no, it doesn't. It, that so unbreakable is not the same as immune to psychology. He's immune to psychology and, and unbreakable. unbreakable. So unbreakable means he he'll never take a break test. Is unbreakable. However, it, it says in that one, even if they would automatically pass a morale check for any reason, they still have to take this test. Okay, but they give ground instead. However, I can't do it because he's not in range. Okay, and neither are they. It's unfortunate. So they're not going to do that. Instead, that, so that's it. Then I do my movement, which he's got five inches left, which puts him there. Then into the shooting phase, movement phase. Don't want to do any more. I'm going to cast arcane urgency on that unit. Try and cast arcane urgency on that unit, aid. Okay, I'm just seeing. Oh, have I moved in range? That's 24 inches? Then yes, I have. Are you sure? Because he's close. Oh, no, it's not. It's well in aid. I mean, you're overhanging my base okay. by a couple of inches, by an inch and a bit. So, uh, this is cast on a 10 plus. Bollocks. Yes. Not as bad as it used to be. <laughs> <laughs> you can tell how often it's happened when you're having to get the charge. It's happened more often to me than you'd think, though. I reckon in every game I've played, I've miscast. It's happened more than one in 36 Yeah, times. more than the one in 36 would, it would make you believe it will happen. A, a yeah, five. I only roll aid. one. I think. Yeah, two d six. It's a five. I've rolled aid. Miscast. Oh, it's on the front. Oh, good. Five. Calat- uh, calamitous detonation. Oh god. Rolling magic explodes and the wizard in a flash of light. Centre as three inch. So oh, I think just him then. Be him. Template over the wizard. Every model, friend or foe, whose base lies beneath. Uh, the template risks being hit. Well, he is underneath, so he has to be hit because he's hit by the hole. Suffering a single strength six with an AP of minus two. Well, the AP is irrelevant, but he's toughness six, so it's a four plus. You may as well roll this because it's you trying to wound me. Bollocks. So he takes a wound. Oh, look, AIDS found these out. Didn't you give him regen? No, 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 no. None of that cack. I wish. I wish. I have forgotten. But it doesn't say anything about not being able to spell or do anything else. Cool. So I'm assuming you can carry on as normal. I did forget to do his goddamn pot, which is irritating. Do it. Are you sure you don't mind? No. Yes. So it's a leadership test for him. He's only going to be an eight, isn't he? He He's an eight. That's a six. So that passes. So he has got regen five. And everybody within his command range... I don't know whether or not I'm lying about that. I'm sure that's what I just read. To the start of the next phase, this character and any unit they have joined, that's nobody. Okay. So he um, he gets regen five for that wound that he's just taken. I've rolled a one. Okay. So no. But he's got regen until the start of my next turn. Maybe he should join that unit. No, because then he's in combat. Nobody wants that. Right. Shooting phase then. So that's conveyance, which I failed to cast. Now into the shooting phase, because you said that my miscast doesn't stop me from casting spells. Nope. Cool. I'm going to try Pillar of Fire then. Nine plus, that goes off on. That's a three. That is really close to two miscasts in a single turn. That would have been comedy gold right there. You say that, I don't think it would have been. I could have done that into a short. And, you that, and then I could have put like, 
60 seconds later. <laughs> Andy realises he hasn't done regen. It doesn't matter. So a three and a four is a seven. Is a seven. So that also doesn't go off unless the Halfling cookbook makes things easier to cast. It does not. No. Nope. So that is, I mean, that is quite frankly a horrendous magic turn. Unless, of course, you consider that I've got plus two toughness on those boys. When you think about the old days. Yeah. And I don't want to do this a lot because people will do it to death. Yeah. He could have killed your wizard. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the wizard could have just gone, nope. And I think a five on 2d6 on the old one was really bad. Yeah. It, it was, was a lot. It's not as bad as it used yeah, to be. Yeah, it's exactly. It's not like the end of the game if you um, if you fail this. No, 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 no. So none of that stuff matters to me at all. So we go into the combat phase. Aid. I do have impact hits. Okay, I'll get the stats up for the mangler squig. They are D three impact hits each. I feel I should take a photo. Boing of the mangler squig. Being charged by hippos. I love it. <laughs> so these guys do D3 impact hits each. Yep, and they they both be in contact. Yes, so that's four aid, Okay, which is statistically average. What's the toughness of a mangler squig? So the mangler squig says I. is toughness five. Toughness five, strength five, force to wound. Statistically average, two wounds. Uh, they are... AP minus one. They are armor bane as well, but which is great. I don't think I've got. He's got scaly skin. I think you said. To splat large target, random attack, spike ball and change, random movement, stomp attacks and timber. You, I'm sure you said he had scaly skin. That is from that though, and not the book. So let's have a look. When you were reading it off your phone, I thought you said, oh no, you're right. You were reading it in the book, weren't you? I'm sure you said he had scaly skin. Heavy armor. Heavy armor. So that's minus one. So six. Colossal, yeah. So four, say four. Two. No, just the two six ups. Of course, of course. Absolute horseshit. Absolute horseshit, viewers. Now you've gone more than three inches in three. Yeah, so to adding all your three to my initiatives, which makes me initiative five across the board. Aid. I'm initiative three. Should he survive? Okay, Koki. So, in which case, no, I'm not, because they're armed with great weapons. So. Takes him down to not the the mourn fang. You mourn fang will go first, then them and him at the same time. Well, that would make me initiative four, four, wouldn't it? Not initiative three. So So he's still still me all at the same time. Okay, great. Uh, Which is good news, I think. So they get three attacks each, four for the champion. So it's seven attacks total, and they are fear. Do you? Does your guy cause fear then? He should cause fear. He doesn't have it on his thing. I'll check again. Mangler Squigs. It's the first time this has ever happened to me, kids. First time ever. He's a monster. Colossal Fang Gob. Counts as heavy armor. Not in there. Right. Um, behemoth. Because I'm wondering. Should we have if... a look at the Behemoth special ones? I've clicked on the link. I'm just oh, waiting for you. Oh, 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 brilliant. This is a really good app. It's, it's a just great not app. a good reception in here, is it? Oh, do you want me to do it, mate? Because I'm sure that I, I haven't got any Behemoths. Oh, I would. The line goes across, but. The page doesn't change. Oh, so does it not? Do you want me to have a look at it? Here we go. This category includes such terror... No, includes such terrors as Dragon's Ab, but it doesn't say causes terror. Oh, okay. Monster. I may have clicked monster last time. Oh, okay. Monsters are split into two categories, monstrous creatures and behemoths. Well, he's a behemoth. So you click on monsters. Yeah. I can't see it. I would be tempted just to check in your in the Ravening Horde's book... And just to make sure that he hasn't missed out fear, I don't understand how that thing does not cause fear when an ogre causes fear. Yeah. You know what I mean? Well, they're scared of elves. Mengi squeak. Because all the focus seems to be on them not being scared. I just assume oh, they don't mean psychology. So yeah. that it doesn't so, so they don't take a fear check anyway, but they don't unless they cause terror. It's it's not there. Mangler squeaks, a careless beast bound merciful unfortunately. Can lead them to injury when they encounter terrain. Cool. Okay, so uh, you don't cause it. I don't cause it to you because you're immune to psychology. Yeah. So that's not going to affect us in the I, least. I think they're designed to hit like a glass cannon. Yeah, and then... Well, I say glass cannon. Strength, a toughness five glass cannon. A toughness five glass cannon. It's going to be great. Uh, there's my More opinion. cannon than glass. <laughs> right, into game view again. But they only have four wounds, Andy. Okay, so, and they've taken one already. Okay. So they are killable. Oh, well, I'm feeling slightly more confident about it. Um, I am only weapon skill three. They are weapon skill four. Oh. So you hit me on fours. Hit me on fours regardless. Okay, so fours to hit. 
Oh, I've got better average. average. Um, and then I am strength six, because plus two for great weapons. Oh, you're doing your great weapons first? Yes. Yeah, God. Oh, I should have done it the other way around, shouldn't Doesn't I? Doesn't matter, because they all go They'll before you. They'll go before you anyway. Um, so, I'm hitting, so I'm wounding on threes then, because you're tough to six. No, tough to five. five. So twos then. Oh, I dead. Is he heavy armor? Minus two is seven. Yeah, he's dead. Dead. So he, even if it wasn't two, he's still dead. Yeah. So you need three to kill him. So before you take him off, though, we have a roll off aid. Is that how timber works? That's how timber works. The winner of a roll off. Oh, the six is good. I think it could be okay. Don't roll a six again. Okay. So we pick the arc that he falls over in. It's not going to hit It's not going to hit anybody because I'm not picking forward. Yeah. So um, I'll put my guys where he was. Got him? So that's where they go to. Oh, sick. That's a great work aid. Cheers. Tar. And then now you decide. I decide whether or not they try and restrain or they reform. What is that where is that the way that giant's facing? In, in yes. is he right, okay, then I will con- I'll move on, I will aid. It uh, so you don't need oh you're rolling for distance. Yeah, rolling for than... distance, rolling for restraint. Let's have a look. I can go five inches. Five inches will take me out of your range anyway, won't it? We'll yeah. take it to there. Yes, it's it. Oh, but Though um, you can't charge me, right? Because I'm in your rear arc. Now I'm not in your front arc, so they can't jump into me. Is that right? They are right. They're skirmishers. Yes. So they have a 360 vision, oh. but they can only charge what's in their front arc. Oh, okay. So, so that's, that's their front arc. To, to me, if you're not in the front arc, they you can't, can't charge. Jump. So then five inches is enough. I'll just go the five inches. I can spin move. them around. I don't even think they do spin because they're skirmishers. They, skirmishers just they just go. move that direction. Of course, yeah. Okay, I, I've got them in the movement trays for ease. Yes. Okay, so I'm so, just going to go, if right. you don't mind, pushing it up to my tray. Or, or the models, either way, to be honest with you. Love going it. up to the tape. Oh, yeah. I'd move up to the tape, except I've got massive teeth. Now, they don't get to reform, right? They just go that way. That's where they're sitting. You didn't move those, Andy. What's that? Right, which oh, you can do. Didn't move any of them. But that's yeah, I've just noticed. Okay, I, I, what I will do is blah, go on, fuck it, we'll march them then. Eh? Cheers, mate. Top. I appreciate you. And I now it's Thanks. because got excited over yeah, here. Yeah, exactly. Me? Yeah. I'll go to there. Those guys will move up. And you don't get to pivot at the end aid. You don't get to. So they just go in that way. And that's it. Okay. That's where they've gone to. That's where they're at. That's all they're doing. So I am gonna worry. About where about where they're going. Well, you've a, taken out four points. Oh yeah, yes. Four points, and I had to, but I've got to kill 40. Sick. Got to look up. He's going to be fine. He's going to be fine. I've got this game in the bag. It's going to be great. All right. So that goes with it. Oh, no, that now falls off because it's the end of my turn. That's only till the end of my turn is Toothcracker. Now, I know it might wind people up, but we are two people learning the game. 100%. And sharing our experience. Yeah. You had. Pistols on one of these I've guys? I've got pistols on them. Yeah, I have. If they're within 12... They, they, well, mine are 24. They because the they shot. are... They're not pistols. They are handguns of the Empire. Okay. You didn't march them. You only nope. moved them. I only moved them three inches. So... Oh, yeah. Okay, great. Let, if, as long as you don't mind, I'll no. take... That was very kindly again. Right, so I do get minus one for multiple shots. Okay. Due to their comparatively small size and ability to make all of the available cover... Enemy units shooting at skirmishers that consist entirely of models with a unit strength of one. So I've got that wrong. Suffer minus one. Oh, so you don't so have a unit strength of one because a unit strength of two. two. Okay, cool. And even that, a unit strength of one is like a single person. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a model with yeah. skirmish. But so even if they were on foot, that's a unit strength of five. No, it's the model has a unit strength. Okay. So if each model, if I'm shooting at a unit, each one of those has a unit strength of one. So if they were on foot, they get the minus one, they they don't because they're bigger. because they're they're bigger. So I get two, four, six. No, I don't. I only get four because I didn't have enough points. They've got motley armament, so they can all be armed differently. So we only get four shots. I'm at minus one for long range and minus one for multiple shots then. And that's it. Okay. So they're normally hitting on a four. Five sixes. This is very kind of you. I there think after all the- oh, I've hit once. Uh, immune to take you haven't had a random movement. I don't think they've got any armor. I don't know what the uh, strength of these is. Uh, I'm toughness three. Oh, okay. I think they're strength four, but they actually haven't got the rules for ogre pistols in here. I'm guessing it's in my book. It's in my book. Yeah, but most guns, gunpowder guns, yeah, are, are strength four AP. minus one AP, aren't yeah. they? 
So two. even if so they do three, it's a six. It would wound you regardless. A six is armor piercing as well, isn't it? So it's actually minus two. You don't care. You've got no armor on. So on to turn number two. two. God, that took us forever. Well, for you guys, that would have seemed like ten minutes. Yeah. In reality, you'll be thinking, how fast are they? It was several hours are, worth of gaming. Are not fast. You know, so I have to declare my charges before I do compulsory moves. Correct. Well, my giant can't charge through them. No. And I don't think he, although he went stupid distance last time, he's got an average of ten, hasn't he? Yes. And that is ten. Oh, sweet. So on average, he makes. He it. makes it. But. I don't declare him, he just does it. Yes, he's in random say, movement, which is in yeah. remaining moves. Is it, so, oh, isn't compulsory movement first? I thought you declared your charges. Well, you do spells first, don't you? Oh, that's valid. You're so, absolutely right. So, right, here we go. Itchy Nuisance is a remains in play, but that's a hex which would come now. Yes, yes, it would. Until the start of your next turn. Right, okay. So I am going to attempt, Andy, a enchantment on himself, um, which he can do while he's in combat, but he's not. He's not in combat anyway. Um, I need a nine. Uh, this is to give me re-roll of ones. Oh, on plus, everybody within his command and range. And plus one right? AP, yeah. Cool. Need a nine. Well, that's irresistible force aid. That is me. Fourteen. Well done. However, you. the staff dies. Because oh, I've rolled you've rolled a double. So the staff goes. So okay. No more staff. No and more there staff. is a consequence to the staff dying. Oh, do you take a wound? I think is it's what you said. <laughs> it's yeah. all and goblin. If only. Of course it is. <laughs> if only. I love this. I love um, this game. Staff of Badoom. <laughs> Badoom. It's the large template, I'm sure it is. Oh, God. This could be bad news. Eh? Oh, it's going to get the other unit. <laughs> you get everybody. It, even the app doesn't want to tell me what it is. <laughs> oh, I can look this up if you want. Do we do it? It's Staff of Badoom. Staff of Badoom. I mean, the app is fantastic. It's, it's brilliant. The only, Oh, here we go. You got it. Right. Strength. Right. Every right. Uh, five inch template. Yep, that's the big one. Is it centered over him or over the unit? Over him. Okay, great. It's gonna hit a lot. Oh, good question. Center of five inch over the bearer. Bearer, cool. Every model friend or foe suffers the risk. So I would say from there. Yep. I'll count the definites first. Yep, sure. Uh one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. Ooh. Right. Five from this unit. Yep. Oh, two okay. Two from yep. this unit. So that's five and two. Cool. Sorry. Six from this unit because six, it yeah. includes him. It includes him as well, yeah. And he's under the template whole. But, oh, no. It doesn't, no make, a he's a, yeah. it doesn't make any difference because it's all the same trend. Yep. So cool. that's six for this unit, yep. two for that. Yep. And then you've got one, two for this unit. Partial on that one. Yep. And oh, one, two, three, four, five. And five partials for that unit. So that Six. is the five. So the five partials on that unit aid is three of them. Yeah. So just so put them up and add them to my six. And then the two partials on that oh. unit is what a perfect average is. I love it. I love it. Right. So the three in that unit take, is it strength six? Three in this unit, strength th six. Yes, yeah, so we're on twos. Three dead guys. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, no. Is there any AP? Uh, one. Okay, so minus one. So they get an armor save then, like armor and shields. Thank you, Andy. Oh, look at that! It saves one, one as well. Look, so only two die. And then the hit the boss's unit. Um, all I need to do him, him separately, him don't separate. I? Yep, yeah, takes a wound. Definitely him. He doesn't, uh, he have doesn't Yeah, doesn't have any armor, does he? So he just takes a wound. Don't put it back in the pile. So I'll put that on the back because yes, he's the only one who can take more wounds. So two, four, six, seven, six, seven, and I'm looking for sixes. Yes, sir. No, sixes. that's unfortunate, isn't it? So seven, seven, seven of those boys. So super die. So that's six, seven. So they are leadership six, seven. Okay. Because they've the, taken it in yes, any, any, in any phase. Is it the end of the phase though, Aid? Well, I think it's. Oh, it's as soon as but you only take one per phase. Sorry, yeah. you're right. You are right. That's so right. that's unfortunate, nice lads. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, no, you can't flee off the table because you've only got 10 inches. So there's no way that... Oh, they might. Well, they're not. At, they're falling back. From the near... From the closest unit, isn't it? Because they're closing back by wounds that aren't caused by me. So they're fleeing that way, aren't they? Well, and they fall back in good order because they're not below 50%. Yet. Correct. So they're not fleeing. They? No, they're over 10. They're, fl they're falling back in good order. I take the highest. The highest, yes, sir. Three. So three inches. Plus a, but... They will pop, won't they? Yeah, but they'll take a test now, won't they'll they? Take a test, yeah, because yeah. they've been fled through. That wasn't ideal, 
That's the risky take. But, the 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 but giving D three extra on every spell is outrageously good. Yeah, and one you know it's going to happen in a battle. Yeah, but hopefully they're not next yeah. to each other. Yeah, so. They go. They will pop, pop the other side, and because they go more than three, essentially, yeah, they'll stop. Exactly there. right. Yep. Yeah. More than happy. Yeah. Go. Gotcha. No, they would be facing that. No, way, they won't be because they rally because they oh. throw them back in good order, so they automatically rally. So they can face any direction you like. So I'll do that then. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Then these, because otherwise they might flee through them. There they are. Six, seven, eight, not nine. Not nine, eight. Yes, you're right. No, they're pissing wait, off as well. No, wait, no, 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 wait. No, 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 wait. Oh, no, because they've got a hero in there, aren't they? So you, yeah. it's the same. Yeah. Oh, God, they're fleeing. Cool. So they're fleeing from... Uh, the closest, which is them. The closest, which is them. So they are fleeing backwards. Okay. Four inches. Plus four which inches. We'll put them there, I'm guessing. Yeah. I think that's as close as I can get them. Now, listen. Because he does say to nudge them round. Yeah. Do you... Do the, do the guys die? In the old game, the fanatics died if they fled. No. They don't anymore. Good. They, okay. uh, no, they um, essentially... They, they only die... Just, yeah, yeah they, okay, superb. They only die if the unit dies. Brill. Not ideal, but on the plus that's, side... That's everybody, the staff of Badoom. Everybody within... But the spell goes through. Seven inches of him has got minus one AP and... Can re-roll ones and, and re-roll re-roll ones in combat. Yeah. 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 So that goes on him. Yeah. That was worth it. <laughs> I don't think he's in range of anybody now either. No, because it's a 15-inch cast on these other spells. So, I mean, right. he's done what an orc would do. He'd run off. I'm glad there was no itchy itch in there. Bad news, rising is a hex, assailment, and conveyance. Conveyance is in the movement phase. Yes, sir, which is now. Yep. Ouch, that hurt. So, charges. Yes. Well, I don't there have anything unless, there. Yeah, because you can't declare the giant, can you? can't see anyone to charge, can he? Yep. Because they are out of his... Yes, correct. Um, you are right, by the way. It's um, charges and compulsory moves is later in the okay. in the thing. So let's roll for him. Come on, then! Now, the way I'm playing is I roll a move. Yes, you have to move. the. It says you have to move the full distance. That is the distance that but, they move. You know, if you were being gainy, I feel you could roll them all, then move them all. But um, I, I don't think that... Yeah, I don't think so. I think they are random movements. Yeah, they are. You don't know what comes yeah, next. Yeah, I agree. That's exactly that right 10. there. You were exactly right about the uh, about the average rolling. I love it. So he has to go into them. He doesn't well, he have to. I can pivot him and move him yeah, elsewhere. Yeah, you can go elsewhere. Can he do them? Because he will be going before they do. Oh, 100% he will. Okay. Well, he's going in there and he has to maximise, so that's what he's done. I like that. These? Yep. They also roll 10. 10. Are they close enough? Good question. No, they are not. Which is nice for me, because I don't think I stand up to so the boat. they stop an inch away, or I can pivot them and move yeah. them that way. No. Do they go in a straight line? No, because no, they don't wheel. They don't pivot, they wheel, don't they? So what I will do... A I'm bit moving. of a wheel, and then as much as you want. You'll just hit me then, though. Yeah, but then you're either moving them sideways yeah. or backwards. Cool. These guys? Yep. <laughs> Ten yep. again? Ten again. It is. Exactly that, right, mate. That's going to happen. Whee! Smashy, smashy. They're all in... Yes. Combat. All in base contact. Now, this fella... Yes, he's in remaining moves as well, isn't he? Yeah. I think they bounce off them. Oh, Jade, I think... Hang on. Just just so... I think... No, you're right. It's compulsory, then... Rem- so, this is in the compulsory moves. So, you have to do them first, then he's remaining moves. So, you actually aren't allowed to move him before you move them. Yeah, but, that, but you haven't, so it's fine. Yeah. It's only, that's it's the first time you've ever played with the charges come first. So it's charges first, then compulsory, yeah. then remaining. As far as I'm aware. It is. Yeah. That's exactly what it is. I've just read it in the book. Um, that's unlucky. One extra inch for them. It is what it is. Isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I, yeah. I rolled perfectly average there. They bounce off them, so does the giant go in after them? And therefore, do you then minimise the charge distance that I get? Because then I'm not getting extra... Initiative. initiative. I know you've got spells to do the initiative. No, I don't. Really. <laughs> it don't exist in my arsenal. Does this, the decision I have, do I commit him to fight them or do I get him ready to defend against these? Uh, That's okay. what I'm thinking. Yeah, okay. Do these have enough to help fight off them? I think with the fanatics, possibly. I've got to do me man first, haven't I? Because there's no shooting. Yep. So this fella. Yep. So look him up. He's initiative many. Me- is your impact hits? I have impact. think he has impact hits. Yeah, it's gonna be great. He's gonna kill them dead. Right. So the app is brilliant. 
A hundred percent. But you do have to click and then click on like I've clicked on him. Now I'm clicking on Cave Squeaks. Yeah, and that Cave Squeaks then has to load. Impact hits D three. Sweet one. Well, unlucky. Strength. They are strength five. Threes. Nice. Um, there's, I, there's, armor don't save? say. Uh, oh, because impact hits. Impact hits don't have that. Yeah. So um, I'm on a five of armor save then. Looks like it. Because there's no AP. Yeah. On the message. I just really says made AP. it initiative ten. Oh, no one. No shock. No banner on them. Just a wound in it. No, just a, oh, god, yeah, thanks. Fair um, put a wound on him. Then it's into the normal game view. That's this one. So he is initiative eight. Nice and, <laughs> initiative eight. And they are initiative six. Or the then giant. You are oh. you are so far beyond me, aid. So he has four attacks. Sweet weapon skill five. Nice. Hit on threes five. Four attacks, yeah. Yep, four attacks. Hit on threes. Threes. Nice. Average. And strength four. He is strength four, but he's got. Did I? Did you give him anything? I don't think I did. Ruby ring, ring, ring. No, I'll give him the ruby ring, <laughs> ring. I don't think I ticked the box. I think you have to tick a box. Let's just have a look. If you've got points spare, give it him aid. I don't. Okay. I have one point spare, but oh, it's okay. going to cost more than a point. Cost two points. <laughs> Can we spare? Yeah, so he's just got a hand weapon, so it's his normal strength, not plus he's one. Probably showing four. Um, oh, because he would have had a cavalry spear, wouldn't he? That's the only reason I was thinking about it. Yeah. So, strength four. Toughness four. Toughness four. So four. Two. Nice. Uh, no sorry. AP. No AP because it's hand weapon. So I am five plus. I haven't made a single five plus. I didn't save yet. No. no it, uh, uh, so that is disappointing for you. Three wounds so far. Then it's the giant cave squeak. Yeah, which will probably do more damage. Who has three attacks. Weapon skill four. Yep, so he's three to it, me then. That's a scanner dice. Oh, oh that's just, just a one. I, I think I'm up on the deal so far. Yeah. Um, so five. Why? Because he's strength 10. If you hit, but you wounded with everything, Aid. Yeah. Yeah, so you. Oh, did you wound with everything? I can't remember. I didn't hit with everything, and I've done three wounds. So if you did hit with everything and you've done three wounds. It doesn't matter, I forgot. No, you've done two. Well,. Okay, so take, let's say he's taking two wounds then, instead. No. Are you sure? Well, do you want to roll it back? He's taken one wound. I've got so one for the impact, and then there was two got from the attacks. And then two from the attacks. And but, I rolled a one for, for wounding. I'm sure I did. So one extra wound? No. What, sure. What I'm saying is, I hit. I know I didn't hit with all of them. Right. Which Yes, which is in effect by the strength So that's ten. three. Yeah. And then I rolled a one for a wound, so, so the two most wounds. Done, it made no difference. Okay, great. Okay, fine. As long as you're happy with that, yeah. I'm happy and with that. And the wallop has one hit wonder has gone now. Has gone. It's just a normal. Cool. That's why I didn't give him the spear. That's why you didn't give him a spear. Although you could have given him a spear because you could have used that after his first attack. Got up something and died. Uh, I think I might be lying at the end of all that because he's just got the ruby ring of ruin. Oh, okay, so he hasn't got the wallop as one. Doesn't matter. You've done the wounds. That's all I do. Now let's see what this... The strength five, the case, because that's what his impact hits were, so it must be. It's going to be strength five, isn't it? I'm just seeing... Oh, what his more actually does, yeah. see whether there's uh, AP on it as well. Try and cave squeak. Because he may have AP. Yes. That's what we're looking for. Quite right. But he's only on one, so... But it might be strength plus one for his more, because his more might be better. I don't know. He has an armoured hide, so he does have the thing... Hatred Dwarfs, Impact Hits, Random Movement, Loner. Doesn't, massive Gob is going to be the equipment, isn't it? Do Minus you, do you one. Do you see Random Attacks Aid? No. Oh, I think uh, Random random, random Movement. Yes. He the big guy. More. Oh, he's got Random Attacks. Cool. Right. Massive Gob, Minus one. Cool. But strength. And Armour Bane. Sweet. So that's on wounds anyway, isn't it? Yeah. And Killing Blow. But that doesn't affect you. No. So what am I looking to do? Threes then. <laughs> After all that, who cares? <laughs> so the squid did nothing. Okay. So I get five attacks back, four because he's a champion, four because he's a champion, and then one for his iron fist. Yes. He hits on fours. Better than average. Ouch. Because I've got armor bane as well. Uh, he's strength four. I I am Toughness three. Come on. He's a goblin. I'm tough no, he's toughness four. Absolute horse. It's because he's on that, isn't it? Must be. Does it give him plus one toughness? It's just got toughness, just toughness four, four. four. Probably not. Three wounds, Aid. I'm so sorry. No, he has light armor, shield, and the armored hide. Cool. So I am. There's no armor pierce on. This is the hand weapons. So four ups. I think. Let me just check that. Sorry. Because of iron fists. Iron fists. Yeah, they've got iron. They've got armor bane, but they are not. Yet yeah, there are no uh, thingy. Okay. So threes. I'm looking for four ups. So he takes a wound. Takes a wound. That takes that down to two. Okay. 
Close order or open? He doesn't say. If I click on him, <laughs> I know I'm having to click on him. I can't see it. So, do you know what I think it is? See, I it think... says it in the in the units. Yeah, I was going to say, I, I think it's only it. units that have it. That's okay. why, because none of your characters have got. Yeah. Yeah, goblin close, mouse, order, close order. order open. So you don't get plus one to your combat race for, no. for for being close order. Then, so I lose by one still because you've done three wounds. I've done one. Neither we don't have banners anymore, but I've got close order and you don't. Even though there's only one guy. If there's only one guy. He's not a character. That's he, the way he, he has it. Um, so they're normally in your ship seven. I want to say, although I could, they could be six. He might be within your general. Oh no, he's not. There's no way he is, because my general's only leadership 8, 9, 10, 11, because I've got plus 3 because of the half link cookbook. So that gives me an 11-inch. I thought your general was 12. No, your general is his command range, unless he's mounted on oh, something I it was bigger. 12 on foot. 12. Just shows, doesn't it? Well, there, he's not 12 either. Right, so, game view. Ogre. Balls, they are normally 7. The crusher is 7, so down to a 6. A pass on a 3. Yeah. Outrageous. So... You go back two inches. Yes, sir. And I will... I don't know if I can choose to follow or not, but he's going to... Yes, because it's my turn next. Yeah. You don't want me charging you. There you go. Oh, and there's no wounds left on me now because I didn't actually have any wounds. It was just for counting. The yeah, the squid did nothing. That's a so, shame, that. No, no, no guys. You're well before me anyway. It's irrelevant. I don't know. I, because oh, I mean, I've never one. played with these before, do they even have impact hits? Oh, they will have impact well, it's one, I reckon. Impact hits one. Ooh. Strength three. Ah, the bounder squig, strength five. Same strength as a cave squig. Damn. So five on threes. Oh, wait, that's a disappointment. Three ones. Uh, so three, five up saves. This is where rolling ones would be useful. Nothing. That's two wounds on them. Now, I am... A higher initiative than me, I'm initiative one. Okay. My... The squig hopper... Sorry, right, I'm scratching my head. The normal guys... Yep. Initiative one. What? The boss... No, I'm reading it wrong. I'm reading the attacks. Oh. <laughs> initiative one. <laughs> Bender Squig's initiative four, base, and the guys are initiative three because they're goblins. Okay. So, so they you're... go to six and seven. Yeah, six and seven. So I'll do the Bender Squigs first. They have two each. Four, ten attacks. six, eight, ten. Let's take out the... Take out the uh, arty dice. You don't need that ever. And then strength five. What, uh, what weapon skill three. Oh, so... Weapon skill two. Right. The bonus squigs rep skill four. Fours. No, threes. Threes. Threes and threes. Threes and threes. Yeah. Oh, if these don't do the damage, they're doomed. Yeah, they're in trouble, yeah, for sure. And then five. And then strength five, toughness four. Threes again. I they're not oh, armor they're bane. Armor bane. It's a shame. Because there's a lot of armor no, bane. There's, there. six, four sixes. sixes. So four sixes and um AP. Uh I don't think Impact hits has a piece. This is not impact hits, this is your attack aid. Unless you did 10 impact no, hits, no. you'd be really pissed. Right, I need to look at Bounder Squigs. Yeah. So, right, Goblin Hoppers. Huge Gops. Could be minus one. Strength eight, minus eight. one, and they are Armour Bane. So it's minus two, because they were all sixes, weren't they? Yes, they were. So that's five, six, sevens. So that's four. That's two guys dead. <laughs> then the guys on the back. I'll take them off. Which is... Six screens. Four attacks for the guys and then two for the, the boss. Weapon skill two, so hitting you on fours. Not, not average. I, I can't grumble. No, no, indeed. Um, these don't have spears. Didn't give them spears. Hatred, immune psychology, impact is like. So they are. Strength three, as a guess. Strength three, so fives. fives. One. And I don't make an armor save. Your armor save. Heaven forbid. Heaven forbid I make an armor save. There you go. So he's at seven. Seven wounds they've caused. Seven wounds. Uh, yeah, I suspect they die, don't I? Well, they don't die. Only one guy gets to fight, don't they? Yeah, only the champion gets to fight. Which is fine, because the champion gets to fight, which is good. But put you on threes, because I'm weapon skill four, your weapon skill... No, I'm not. I'm weapon skill... I don't know what weapon skill I am. What's the weapon skill on an iron guy? I got to only weapon skill three. So they hit you on fours? Yeah, because you don't use the highest. No, you use the, the rider. Mount, the, the, yeah, yeah, the rider, not the mount. I mean, it would have been, it would have been fours regardless. And then twos to wound, unless you're toughness. Toughness three. Toughness three, yes. Two. Of course. Double Jeez. wound two. So, just one wound at minus two aid. So, they. I didn't give them anything. So, that's a wound. Cool. A whole wound, I've caused there. 
So I'm going to re-roll the two hits because I'm re-rolling natural hits of one with the dragon hide banner aid. That's what my fucking rule is. That's what my rule. Oh no, I rolled to wound of one. I yeah. didn't roll to hit of one. I can't remember if you rolled any. Irrelevant. Ones. I did. I don't know. I don't know, and I'm not about to. So I've caused one. Right, you've caused one. Yeah. Well, I've got seven. You've got seven. That's all I've got. Well, we might as well take mine off yours, right? So I caused one wound. I've got a banner. I've got close order. That's it. Lose by four. Yeah. Lose your bait. Lose your bait on him, so it's irrelevant. Down to four. Down to four. Let's go! Let's go! It's okay! It's all fine, lads. It's not fine because the giant's going to charge me in two turns. But other than that, it's fine. It's going to be <laughs> okay. So, you just back up I back two up inches. Two. Two. That's, about, that's about two inches in it. I'm not measuring it. Uh, if I all know, I must do. It's your turn next, It's my it? turn next, yeah. Yeah. I mean, total up to you, mate. No, you don't have just, to. Because you're going last if you don't charge. Yes. Whereas if you go, you'll be going before me. No, don't think so. Even then, I'd only because I'd only be moving two inches. So it'd be initiative three. And even then, I'd, I'd still be Three going. would put you the same as the goblins. Same as the goblins. Whereas now, you hit me before. So it's better this way, isn't it? There's, I don't see a downside. No, ag- agree. Totally agree. I mean, I don't get the impact hits, but I wouldn't have them either. No, you wouldn't get them anyway. And I would. Yeah. So, okay. I mixed feelings. It would yeah. have been nice if I had popped the units. I mean, yeah. if I had popped that, that could well have been game over. 100%. Oh, 100%. But, um, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. So you'd only need to kill one, one more model? Yeah. Two more models and I'd have been dead. Because you'll probably do it. So that you. that was uh, that was how wise you were to take out the Mangler Squig first. Yes. Oh, you were. But these are now horrifically out of position, aren't they? Okay. So because you can't charge me. Correct. Oh no 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 no! We can't see. I'm not going to release the fanatics. Reasonable. At start of my turn, I need to do the um, the butchers. What's it? Which he fails. Good times. <gasps> he takes a wound. Is he stupid? No, that was for his butcher's cauldron. And now I got what? Pidity as well. He's passed that on a oh. four. I'd rather it that <laughs> way round than the other <laughs> end. If I'm really forward. Forward. Oh, there's a giant <laughs> there. It'll be fine. It'll be all right. Right. Then charges. So obviously they'll charge them. Have to hold. The but the the slaughtermaster is going to charge the squigs. Oh, okay. I feel like I probably should charge the giant, but I don't think I hurt the giant. Whereas I think that the butcher could. Giant's tough to six. That's yeah, he's tough to six. Asset, and I'm only strength four. So, yeah, the, 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 he's going to charge them. Now, I think it's an auto charge aid. But yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Five inches. Does the wheel count as how far I move? Do your spells first. That's a reasonable thing to do. Thanks, mate. I'll re roll that dice. Because we get excited. And it's like, ah, I haven't moved this half of the table. Um, right. What are we going to do? I don't actually know what I'm going to do, Aid. I've only got... Oh, I've got... Ooh. Ooh. Let's go Troll Guts on... The names are brilliant, aren't they? Yeah. I, 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 probably. Troll Guts onto the Iron Guts unit. Or onto himself to make him toughness eight. No. Because if he, it's only to the end of this turn, so if we get charged next turn, it's irrelevant. Eleven and four... 15, eh? You could use your double six yeah, I'm not fated gonna... dispel. Right, so they are plus two toughness this turn. Only this turn, not until my next turn. Um, I don't want to do that one. That So that's it. Oh, God, that's it for now, isn't it? I've just thought, oh, no, that's a hex. Well, let's try it. I'm going to try Curse of Cowardly Flight. No, I'm not, because he backs up two inches. He gives ground instead, which is two inches irrelevant. I don't want to risk it. Don't risk it. Thanks, Aid. Thanks for letting me do the spell. Right. He's then going to charge them. I've rolled almost the same dice. So, does he count how far he moves from there to there or from the wheel that he has to complete? You're talking initiative? Yeah, for initiative purposes. Um, I genuinely, it's a question I don't know really the answer. I, it's how far he's moved. Now, he's only yeah. moved from there to there. What I suppose the question is, do you include the movement on the pivot? Yes. Does that include the, the wheel that he does on the way in? I don't know. I would be tempted to go distance travel. Agree. Agree. So I that think... is more than two. It's more than two, but it's not three. So I get plus, plus two. two. Yeah. Fair enough. 
and he goes and sits in there. Okay, then these guys, which again, I think is probably auto, auto, isn't it? But with 11 inches, it's definitely auto. Swash. And he can't do anything else. Remaining moves then. See, the only thing is, do I try and weather the storm of the fanatics? But I don't think, because do you know when you throw the fanatics out, is it, it can be from there out that way, right? They have to be within three inches of the unit. Oh, so they, they come out and about, about there then. And then I send them off. Oh, and then they and then they move from there randomly from there. I choose the direction, but they move random distance from there. And then after that, it's totally random. I'm gonna get smashed by them. They don't stand up to six fanatics. And at this stage in the game, I think you go, yeah, cool. I'll take two bulls to kill them with six fanatics, even if some of them die. What did you have to get me down to? I have to kill. I have to kill one of those. I need to get you down to twenty. So if you've got to get me down to, to twenty, then I've, I've got to kill one of those units. Yeah, because they're worth forty combined, aren't they? Well, they were, but not so much now. But they're close to but forty. They're, but they're still, they're going to stay where they are. They're just going to pivot aid. I've done that in good faith. Is that all right? Where yeah, they are yeah, like that. Yeah. That okay. It's a reform, isn't it? Yeah, a reform. Yeah, but it's it's pivot about the centre, though, isn't it? I didn't want to. Give myself inches no, whilst no. I was moving like that way. Okay, that's the end of my movement. He now can't cast any more spells unless it's rain self, uh, which I don't yeah. have any. Combat, we could do on yourself, couldn't we? Yeah, no, com- no shooting because I'm in combat. So into the attack phase. Um, these guys get one impact at each, and he is, uh, and they are strength five. Toughness three. So twos, of course. Do you have something that re-rolled ones? No, that's on them. Natural rolls of a one is on them, the bat, the dragon high banner. So that's two aid. Um, I don't think they have armor. Well, they don't have armor. I'm not sure about the thing. Is it AP? No, no, because it's just... I'll um, roll to see if it matters. Yeah, if it matters, yeah. No. No. So cool. two die. And then I've moved more than three inches, so I'm initiative um, higher than ogres. They are. Not more than Gav. Man, it is. So they're initiative six then aid. I will issue a challenge. I know I should have done it before. Oh, you no. You right to tell me Does not it, to. Is that, is, that, is that something that happens before? Oh, because these are attacks. And, yeah, I don't care. That's fine. Now, I should have issued it before because you'd have rolled your impact hits separately because the impact hits would go on him. Oh, uh, would go on him. And there's a good chance you could have killed the champion. I would have champion killed the champion before. Because he he's only got one wound, hasn't so he? So I've left it too late. If, if you're happy doing that, I'll... Yeah, we'll carry on. You sure? This. Yeah. Okay. So, um... Oh, that's a lie, because the champion has got a great weapon. So he is he is initiative four. Yeah, but we'll just leave it, because... But I more mean, in the running order of this turn, does it matter? It doesn't, no, cool. because your guys will get... Your guys will kill them first, I, I think. I, oh, I don't know. I, so they've got, they've got four attacks each, Jade. I have... Ogre's got stomps. No. Okay. No, they don't. They've got... The, For you, Sue, didn't they? They're really good. They've got Ogre Charge now. An Ogre Charge means that they get an extra strength and AP for every rank that's directly behind right, them. Okay. So they're really good when they do the charge, but they lose the stomp. Um, my guys are Weapon Skill 4 aid. Um, I'm Weapon Skill 2. So you double. Pick double up. the changes to 3. Oh, no, or is it twos. double plus 1? Well, it's not double plus hit- it's double plus one. It is double plus one. No. Oh, yeah, because I'm five and you're two. Yeah, yeah. okay, so I'm twos then. Jesus. Oh, shit. And these are... Didn't look. Pay attention. Uh, these are... Strength five. Toughness yeah. three. So, toughness three, all twos. Them. All of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. They did. They did. Um, I will reform. They do hit like a train, don't yeah. they? Oh, yeah, ogres do. Absolutely do. But I'll just reform... Like that, I think. Yeah, that'll do. I'll do this one now. Screw it. I may as well do it now. Because I think your boss probably kills him. Base initiative, isn't it? Yeah, base initiative now. Yeah, absolutely. I don't have the Wallopers one hit wonder anymore. Which is nice. So I'll do the um, Giant Caves Greek first. Is he in, what's his, because his, his, initiative, his initiative's better though, surely. He's initiative five. Yes. The so. Caves Greek is initiative three. So, so okay, yeah. I'll do it that way around. Yeah, just because so. that's the way we should do it. Kate. Yes, yes, that's no, you're right. So four attacks. Yep. Hitting, I'm um, weapon skill five. I'm weapon skill three. So four, uh, threes. threes. Bonk, bonk. And then strength four, toughness four. four. So fours. Absolutely horrendous. No AP. 
I made one! And then the beastie has three attacks, weapon skill four, so threes again. Yep. All of them. Uh oh. Threes to wound. He strength five. Yeah. Toughness four. Oh, he's done, he's done nothing. Oh, he's he? done nothing. He's done nothing. Oh, God, that's good news. The beast has done nothing in two rounds of combat. That's really good news. That's really good news. Okay, so five attacks back. <gasps> oh, you had it in the bag. I'm hitting you on fours. You sure not a dwarf? No, definitely no dwarf. He looks short, he looks short for an ogre. <laughs> short for an ogre. <laughs> I didn't roll my hits. That was wounds. That wasn't hits. Yeah. And then um, I was only in the first round of combat as well. Toughness three. Toughness three? No, he's no. not. He's toughness four. 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 Fours. Two. two. Two wounds. No AP, though. So it's just so your four, four apart. I don't know why you've rolled so many, Aid, because you've only done two wounds, man. I thought you did three. No, I did two. Do you mind if I re-roll? No, of course. Cool. Average. So that's a wound. So you win. By one. Where's the wound? Well, who, no, how have we got no more wound? Oh, go. I don't know what happens now. Well, you lose by one. You take a morale check and see if you flee. Is he... Un- he's immune to psych, isn't he? But he's not unbreakable. But he's not unbreakable, so he does take panic checks at minus one. Okay. On a five. Oh, please. Oh, please. All right. Nope. Oh, he's definitely going. He's off. He's doubled it. But so, he's random movement, 3d6. Oh, no, because f- it's a flea move. Yes. Well, you roll 2d6. The result of this roll is the distance in inches that, you, that the fleeing unit moves. Okay. So it's just 2d6. Is all you get 2d6, and that's what you flee. I won't pivot you. And I, I will pursue, because I think I have to say that before. Yeah. Obviously. I, yeah, okay. Six inches. Ooh. Right, so, none of that nonsense. So you flee directly away from me, because I've caused the most wounds. Yes, the only wounds. That's correct, yes. So then we go back to this nonsense. No, I think it's the largest. I don't think it's anything to do with wounds, because you oh, can lose it? combat, even if you were... Uh... Cause no wounds. Yeah. You're right. So six inches back to back would be that, and then I was facing away from you, so it's that. Okay. So I am surprisingly six inches away from you. Shock. That's exactly as it should be. I hate sometimes. Oh, beastie, this is down to you. Okay. So and you add him in the bag. Then I follow up. I'm going to pursuit move. Roll two d six. The result is how far I go. Nine. <laughs> I rolled. If you catch the curse, I think I kill him. Well, don't take no shit, big man. I don't know why I'm doing this, Aid. Let's go back to nine. There you go. Look at that. Captain Ogre Ball taking no nonsense from uh, from no goblin. Oh, I don't think so, baby puppy. It maybe, is you that is in trouble. Maybe a little ambitious. <laughs> Although, he nearly killed an entire unit of balls by himself. If that beast had done any a, wound, a, a single wound in two rounds of combat, in two rounds of combat, he'd have been, you'd have been fine. Uh, it, that should be mounted the other way around because <laughs> that goblin <laughs> around his back. That's right, it. okay, over on the other side, then. Yeah, the, and I was not quite optimistic I know, about that one. You should have been. <laughs> I think you kill him, arguably. Right, the butcher, not the slaughtermaster. Sorry, he's got um, impact hits two. Okay, he's got so. Um, any challenges from you? Me to challenge first, isn't it? Um, I'll issue a challenge, because you can't say no. With the champ, with my champion. Well, if I can't say no, I can't say no. Because there's nowhere for you to hide, is there? So you have to accept. Cool. So, the um, my guy hits you. He's strength four. That's my champ, by the way, Andy. If okay. that makes a difference to you. Makes no difference to me. Okay. Um, so, that is one wound... Oh, he's tough. He's strength four. Your toughness three. Is that yes. right? Cool. So it is one wound then. Aid normal armor saves apply. I don't think I have armor on these, Andy. Okay. Well, that's great. He does, but I don't think these do. Okay. So that's one. I am initiative five with my um, butcher. I'm pretty sure Just all my guy, goes. the beasts, are initiative four. So it's only okay. So he's armed with the blood cleaver. If um, the wielder of the blood cleaver causes one or more unsaved wounds during the combat phase. They recover a single lost wound. Mangle squid. Interesting. We got uh, now. There's there's no initiative, but it's because they're on horse, isn't it? Initiative yes. three for both. Cool. And the gob is just a weapon, so it's initiative three. So I'm five. So my guy's going first. He is weapon skill four. Hang on, I'm looking. At, I was looking at the mangle squid, not the hoppers. Oh, not the hoppers. 
So initiative three for the guys, the bounders are initiative four. Cool. So I'm still going before all of them because I am initiative five because I've charged two inches. Okay. So um, I've got four attacks and I am weapon skill four. You are weapon skill three. Two. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the uh, the bounders are initiative uh, weapon skill four. You, but they... you fight the riders. Yeah. Made a difference. No. No. Isn't he? He's weapon skill four. Your weapon skill two. So you're hitting me on twos. Am I hitting you? you on twos? Well, it's double, isn't it? It's, I thought it was double plus one. I hit on twos. Robo kids. Hit your weapon skill four. Your weapon skill two. Threes. There you go. So it's only one, but I have wounded you, aid on a four plus. So he causes one wound. Uh, Can't take the champion off be because, yeah, it can only be one of those. I think that's made a difference, to be honest with you. I think that's really important. I think it's important. So is it me next? And then it's you to attack with everything, or right. your champion can only go into my champion. So the squig yep. is going into the champion. Yep. Weapon skill four. No threes. Threes. Two hits. Yep. Strike threes. five. One. Okay. And then it's minus one AP. Is it natural? Yeah, so I've got six up save. <gasps> Oh, it makes it. Oh, it rages new. And oh, then... no, it's not. You're wounding me on sixes. Sorry, Aid. It's irrelevant. I've made the same because I've got plus two. Toughness. Oh, okay. It's fine. It didn't cause strength a wound. Five, anyway. your. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Strength five, toughness six. So it would have been five. You're wounding me on. Okay. Sorry, Aid. Uh, next, squig into the no, unit. The the champion into my champion because we're doing that challenge okay. first. So we? two's hitting you on fours, fives. No threes. Because you're, oh, you're, 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 you're weapon skill two. You're weapon skill three. I'm only weapon skill three on those guys, my, my butcher's thing. So it's far, it's fours you need. Okay. So no hits for those. Then your squig into my guys. Threes and threes we're looking for, aren't we? Nice. No, you're not. You're looking for fives, Aid. What? Six uh, is there? it fives? I'm toughness six, you're strength five, it's fives. But you're still a six, it doesn't yep. matter. And you've rolled a six, so it's no armor save. It's just a wound because you've got armor bane as well. And then the one guy on the back. Yeah, the guy on the back. No. no. Right then, lads, roll up your sleeves. So the champion hits on threes because you're weapon skill two, I'm weapon skill four. No, you, we, we've just done that, Andy. It's still threes. And you're, yeah. I'm weapon skill three, you're weapon skill two. It's always going to be threes, you moron. Okay, three hits. It was a two, so we don't get to re-roll it. Re -roll it. Uh, then it's twos to wound you because I'm strength six, your toughness three. three. Three wounds. He dead. So he's dead, and but he's worth three. He's worth three. I don't think it'll massively matter. And then my unit, do they all, do they, the other two get to attack? Because it's the same initiative, isn't it? Oh, no, because right, if you're going three, to... four. I get yeah. four attacks, okay. don't I? Okay. Yeah, four attacks. I on my fighting rank. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, so I'm hitting you on threes. Rerolling ones. Thank you. Still a miss, but thanks. And then two. Double six at minus two, eight. No armor save. No, super dead. So he's dead, yeah. Yes. yes. So they're all dead. Yes, everybody's dead, Dave. If he hadn't, well, if he, if if he had wheels, it'd be a bike. I'm going to try and restrain. Ooh. Oh no, they don't have to because they didn't charge. It, you can. I've, I'm sure I've read that if you destroy a unit, you can overrun. If I overrun, can I overrun into him? I, yeah, because you would pursue into a new. It would be. I wouldn't fight this turn, but I no. would. But we. I would count as charging in the next round of combat because if they and. I think oh, it's yes. it's said to be like me running off. I think. Right. And when I say I think, I know my think can vary from 15% all the way up to, <laughs> to 95. I'd say this is a 90%. Okay. That you can overrun. Then but, they are going to overrun, but he you, most certainly is not. So you have to roll to see if he doesn't. He has to restrain. No, he's chasing. Okay. So, and they would run off from the unit with the highest strength. Which is them. Yeah. So they would go that way, and yeah. that's the way that they'll both no, pursue. I'm not sure about that, Andy, because they were dead, and you're overrunning. Yes, and I'm overrunning, which so means... He, and he would oh, carry he has to go own. forwards. Would, they have to go forwards as well. You're not, they're say, not allowed yeah. to pivot beforehand. You're right. Yeah. Okay, so uh, these guys are going to roll them first. Yeah, work out which one you want first, yes. because the other might block might the other. Might block the other one. So they're definitely going to go into him. Seven inches, Easy, eight. Yeah. Easy. Wee. So they will count as charging. Yes, but do you mind if I do that? No, no. And then that way we can get them out of the... Fucking, there you go. I think he was about there. And then... I would say they block him. They block him, right? So he can't go anywhere. That falls off because it's the end of my turn. Yeah. 
and it's your twa. Goes quick, doesn't it? It sure does. Now, we know that a unit's been destroyed in combat. The giant would have to take a panic check, but he's immune to psychology, and I'm he's, sure he's, immu and he's unbreakable, so it doesn't matter to him at all. A lot of the army has stuff as well where they ignore goblins breaking. Oh, the, yes, because they're insignificant. Yeah, uh, yeah okay. I don't know whether he does. The orcs certainly do. Well, he's unbreakable and um, immune to psychology, so he doesn't care. Well, I feel if I don't release the fanatics now, I never will. Okay. So. I am going to release the fanatics. Hooray! Let them out, lads. There are no charges because these ain't charging. No. Three inch. Oh, nice. That's the reason I've got it. Out. Nice, I nice. Thought, easier, doesn't it, than that? A hundred percent. Because it's within, not completely within. Oh, nice. Okay. But it, so they go touching the edge of that tape. That is fine. Yeah, and it. I'm taking a bit off because it's, it's very meant nice. to be them, oh, not the Oh, because they are the tree, of course. Yeah, yeah. I have to be careful because if these hit each other, yes, they die. Well, there's a good chance they die because they have to take these <laughs> five hits each. But it's not auto death. No, that's true. It's not auto death. It should be, but it's not. So, and are they two d six inches aid? When they, when they, I when will you look. Rolling I'll them. look. I can't remember. All I'm hoping is they don't get me this turn. It's all about those ones. Probably will. It. Um, but you don't mind if they kill him. If, do if you? the one guy dies, I'm not horrendously bothered. I think they're all within three hundred. Yeah. If, Within within reason, Aid, I think you've so tried to do There that. are no charges. Nope. It's compulsory movement, which is now, which is exactly what they are. Which, and they will be in the Night Goblin. Yes, they will. Fanatics. Night Goblin mob. Although it's a bit laggy. It's that's a not the app. app. That's the yeah, thing. It's the internet, isn't it? Because mine is super fast. That's because my internet is good everywhere, apparently. Apart from on the way home from your house. So they're that's not cool. in the Night Goblins. I'm going to have to come out the game view. Here we go. Fanatics. Oh, you got it. I was Movement release. star. Wow. Release the fanatics. Fanatics are not placed on the battlefield. Make a note of which unit, blah, blah, blah. Yep. Start on the start of the sub fate. Yeah. Yeah. Done that. When a fanatic is released, it travels through the air spinning. Whee! You can throw them over your own units, can't you? Which is why you yeah. hide them behind units. Because you can throw them over the top yeah. of your units and not risk hitting them. During the compulsory moves in the turn in which it was released, 2d6. Um, oh, so not yet then. No, it's compulsory. I mean, it will be because there's no charges. But, but there is magic first. Okay. And then if fanatics move, and then after subsequent, it's um, during each and every other compulsory move subphase, and fanatic moves 2d6 in a random direction. <gasps> each and every, that's mine as well. Yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, moving through a fanatic, death of a fanatic. Yeah. We'll look at them later. We'll get them later on. So, okay. So, so magic and magic. Magic until the starting of... So I'll, oh, is it worth shit. it? Because I'm worried I'm going to... I'll tell you what it is worth doing. It's worth moving one of those fanatics with the moving Characters. Move. Oh, is it only characters? A character. Outstanding. So moving 4d6 in a turn is brilliant. I am going to try Itchy Nuisance because I've got someone within 15. Oh, pants. So I'll try it. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it casts on a 9. That's so a 9. 9 makes it a 13. So it's a double six for me to stop it. I'll give it a bash with my fated dispel. 27? I'm not within 27. Oh. There's no way I'm within 27. Nope. So that, I can't even remember what it does. Under Minus three, D3 to my toughness aid. Just the one. Just the one. Makes him a toughness three ogre. It's still harsh. Yeah. The other spells, that one, is it worth doing on a nine? Rerolling one's an AP one. Because I'm so close to the edge of the board, I am thinking, hmm. Mm. But the miscasts aren't that bad. So four and four, and four eight. eight doesn't go off. Cool. See, I think it would be better if when you failed, that was it. That was the end of Because it used to be called broken concentration. Yeah. If you failed a spell. And I think that anymore. would bring the magicians back into line. Back into line a little bit. Yeah, maybe you're right. Uh, Hand of Gork, friendly characters. And Bad Moon Rising is a hex. D3 to weapon skill and initiative. It's 15 inches. Cast on a 10 and a 15. You could do it on him if you wanted, but I actually think you'll kill him with the things rather than... I Yeah, I'm not going to do it. Yeah, yeah. It's possibly not worth remains it. in play. But, I mean, Itchy Nuisance is remains in play, but that one isn't, so... Yeah. So, okay, movement. Yes. I'll, go, I'll go... That left way across. Right. Cool. Right to left, my, your left to right. Yes, yes, yes. This yes. guy first. You'll need a, a scattery scatter as well. No. Oh, no, because straight line isn't... Sorry, yeah, 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 go for it. Dead. Cool. 12 inches. He's dead, aid. I know, I'm just seeing. Would it have nailed him? But he doesn't hit them, does he? No. No, I mean, your guy's dead. 
Because I rolled a double. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> Sorry, when you said dead, I thought, <laughs> no, no, I mean, he's dead. That's it's good. okay. <laughs> I was thinking, that's yes! amazing. Well, no, oh, three. Yes, he's coming back next turn. I like where this is going. Right, I'm going to move him yep. that way. Cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. I will measure. Yes, of course. So seven, eight, seven. ten inches from that unit then, right? So ten inches from the unit would put him there, Andy. Ruh, ruh. Now, you can put him directly in front of that guy, though, can't you? I will swap him out. Oh, for you one that stands up. he would be more, more balanced, stable than you? that guy, wouldn't you? Yeah. And yet, no. He's stable on the tray. Because he's magnetised. <laughs> so, right. And then that guy. Whee! I love this. Yep, six, six inches. It's not terrible averages. I'm just seeing these coming back, hitting me. You're seeing you in the face and ruining your game. Five, five inches. inches. And the last one, so five and six. I would say... Perfect. Yeah, lovely. And then remaining moves, if you want to move those goblins. I guess the only thing that you've got to be concerned about is they move in my turn and your turn. Yeah, I I don't anticipate. All I anticipate doing is maybe that to keep him on the table. Yeah. Purely so one doesn't flee through the other. Oh, okay. Yeah, fair. But I think if... If, if one of them dies, it, you're screwed. It's the end of the game if yeah, one yeah, of them yeah. dies. Yeah, I think... I well, going to get me to 20. You kill the giant. I've got to kill the giant. These will die in turn. Oh, of course, because you've got those five, haven't you? So, they count. Yeah, they do count. If one of these dies, it's pretty much... Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, cool. So, uh, you charge. I did charge. I'm going to need to look at the initiative of the giant. Two. Is he a giant, I reckon? Yeah. I, oh, it might I be think... four, though. You might be surprised. No, I think you're right. Are you sure a giant's initiative two? I'm pretty sure he was. It's not in that. It's game view, in it? Yeah. Game view... Giant initiative two. Cool. So you're going to be going I'm first. I'm going to be going first then. Come here, Iron Guts. I do cause terror. Right, okay. So I need. Oh, but I don't fear you. Because you're massive. Because I've got more units than you have. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, no. Wait. Let's do impact hits. Impact hits first. I'm just going to check Ogre Charge Aid because I think it's complete ranks behind. Yes, is improved by the current rank bonus for the unit, which. Is nothing. So three. Uh, so one, two, three. So these are strength four. Your toughness six. Sixes. Sixes. Triple one. Triple one. Oh, where was Excellent. that with the? Uh, That's good squeeze. news, isn't it? Two, four, six, three, six, seven, eight. Don't need eight. Needs no three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I need. Fucking hell. They're all in combat. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So uh, three each. And an extra one for the champion. Yep. So, um, weapon skill three. Weapon skill three. So, fours to hit, re-rolling ones, because I've got me dragon. I cause back. terror, but you cause fear, don't you? Yes, so that means you cause fear in me, so but you don't worry I about don't it. take fear yep. because I've got... Um, now I get it. I've got more. You've got lots of guys. No ones. Outstanding news. Looks, I thought that looked average, but... And it, it is slightly above average, isn't it? It's one less than average. Oh, three there. Thank you. It's exactly average. You were yep. right. Um, Ten attacks. <gasps> yeah, because three each, and then one, one extra, extra for the guard. Yeah, no, that's yep. exactly right. Uh, so um, I think I'm strength six, toughness six, fours. Oh, shit, it's going to end badly. Okay, so four wounds, eight. Three. I've only got light armor, and you've got... And I've got minus two. So he takes... Four wounds. Four wounds. He's got six in total. Okay, okay. Right. Should have charged. Should have should have charged. I need to look with the which guy. table. So here we go. Two. Belly flop. Oh, pants. The giant crashes down bodily upon the enemy, places a small three-inch template so that it's central hold directly over the central of the target unit. Any model, friend or foe, but not including this model, whose base lies underneath the template, risks being hit and suffers a stringle. A single hit using the strength characteristic of this model with an AP of minus two. So I'm going to say... So the centre of the unit is where? Well, I think because it's a three-inch template, it's probably going to be three partials. Three and partials one and, one, and one defo. So the partials... One. So, so two. Two in total. Strength six. Toughness four. four. Twos. Twos. Yep, two wounds. Two wounds at minus two. So that's one, two wounds. And then he does get stomp attacks. You don't, dear. Do no. D6 stomp attacks. Oh, God. Three. Three. Average. Strength six, so two again. again. Three. But, but no yeah. AP, so it's yeah. five up saves for these. Oh, fuck's sake. You, your saves haven't been good, have they? So that is three, five you've caused. 
I've also caused five. I know you've caused four. Oh, four. I've got a banner and a close order. Yep. So you win by one. I win by one, but you don't care. I'm unbreakable. Because you're unbreakable. That was appalling. That was. That was I, appalling. It just shows how bad giants can be. Yeah, percent. But it's... Get it. I, think, I blocked myself with yeah, the guys. Yeah. And I, don't get me wrong. I'm grateful because now, provided... You, unless you roll, I don't get smashed by them now... Even if you roll a double one. I'm think, still yeah. in, and the impact hits, I hope, will do enough to at least put a couple of wounds, and then he's dead. Yeah. So the giant dies this turn, I would say. So, it's, from what I understand... It's spells, then ch- declaring charges. No, it can't. Then compulsory moves. Start of turn. That's when I release them. I thought you said at the start of every turn they move. You might, compulsory. You could be, you could it's be, in the compulsory. Right. Yeah, you could be right. Because I release them at the start. Oh, then they move they in, move in the compulsory. In the, right, okay, cool. Okay, so start of turn phase then. He is not going to bother with his cauldron, it's pointless because it only gives him he doesn't have to do his stupid first well, it's the both at, at the, the start, start of turn, so I think okay. I get to choose but I'm not going to do the cauldron because he risks taking a wound, be nice if he failed he's stupid, seven, he's fine he's okay, you the one thing they have done in this edition yep. is clamp down on the leadership yes, because in the past every I've, leader is, is was ten, ten because you'd have, somebody in your army would have an eight, a yep. nine and then Chrono Commands. Yeah, 10. yeah. You're, you're absolutely fine forever. There's just no one in the orc With the BSP. Right, so I can't shoot them at all, can I? You can target the ground with templates. So no there. Or I could, if I, t- if I did a template, you and can't shoot them. With, yeah, you can't shoot them with pistols. With the pistols, because you can't target them. It, okay, but cool. You can't direct them, but spells and weapons that direct the ground... Because even if you hit them with a cannon, I don't think it hits them. Oh. It, it has to be a template, I think. Oh, okay. I, so a stone thrower, you could go, I'm going to drop one in the middle of that field for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I'm going to try and do Toothcracker. You do, oh, you've done your stupid, sorry. I've done my stupid. So I'm going to try Toothcracker on them. That's four, and four is eight. So it goes off. I will try yep. and stop it. I, I don't think you're within 24. No. But well, that's unlucky, mate. <laughs> That's unfortunate. So they are plus one toughness. Oh, plus because two. it's a lower level. It's only gone off on a seven. Um. Mm. Oh, I could do that, though. Oh, great. I'm going to play... I'm going to try and cast the Pillar of Fire Aid. Oh, no, wait. When's that? Magical Vortex. I can't do that now, because that's during what's it phase. I'm going to charge with them. No, nope. so there's me two. I see a one. There's a three over there, though, and Swift Stride. Okay. Is a six. Nine. So it's nine inches plus the eight inches off the go. Now, where am I, Aid? I'd say it's got to be rear. Oh, God! It's rear or flank, isn't it? I'd say that because it's off me. I think. Are you I, sure? I, I, I get what you're saying, but he's actually that way round. Yes. Which, but that's because it round to a square base, isn't it? But I just thought it might the majority been... of you, it's got to be in his Fair enough. Off. Okay. I, that's what I think. Okay. I'll, I'll take your charity. Yeah, he's, ne- he's never going to fit, is he? Is that- now, bear in mind that these will be six... Uh, many. Yes. Me- yeah, many. Before me. Yeah, before you in initiative. Because... I've charged a long old way. And he's in the rear, so you get an extra two, don't you? You get one in the flank. Do you get initiative? It's- I thought it was combat res. Now, well, that might be that as well, but I'm pretty sure it's initiative. Three is the max in the front, four in the side. And five, five in the in the rear. I think. Okay. Again, that's in the ninety percent. I, I seem ish. to remember Paul I, reading. Now that you've said it, it makes it makes a little bit more sense in my head. Okay, so that's the charges. Remaining moves. Then it's compulsory before remaining. Compulsory before remaining. You're absolutely right, mate. Okay. I love this bit of the game. This is okay. Me, not so much. So this guy. Yeah, that one. Go for it. I'll do. It's fine. He's rolling there. Nobody cares, mate. Oh, so he's going oh. through him. Oh dear. <laughs> this is going to suck. He's dead! Nobody cares! Oh, oh, no. Oh. I I think he... Oh, I don't know. Right. I if I know. put that, that's in line, because that's Sick. easier to see. Yeah, outrageous. Wait, let's do that. Let's do, let's do, let's do... Oh, it was You've got a laser, there. haven't you? Where's, Where's your there? laser at? Is it in there? Where is it? Have I got mine? If I, got, if I, brought, if I brought mine, I'll get mine out instead. I've put new batteries in and everything. I've got mine. I've also put new batteries in mine. It's cool. Oh, look at how light. Is that right? Is that angle right? 
So, like, th- how do you feel about that? I think if you... Go for it. No, you do it. Make I you think better. That looks right to me. And I, if I put my elbow on this... Elbow on. They look parallelish. Yeah. So... Clips in. You reckon? Yeah, well, it, it clips in within a million, and I'm not going to be a prick about that. Okay. Yeah. So, he's going through the going, court. Yeah, how far is he going, though? It couldn't be any closer to his corner, could it? It couldn't be. Dice it, Andy. Are you sure? Four up, it clips him. Four up, it clips him. It doesn't get so him. It misses him. He is... Captain Indestructible. And how and how far is he going? Well, you're the wrong. I've got the okay. So oh. I'm hitting him in the middle. So do you want me? Do you want me to roll those dice? If, yeah, if go you for it. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's only because I've got it set up. Seven. So seven, seven inches. That ain't gonna be enough. It's it? not gonna get him. I don't think. But I, it's easy to measure. Oh, yours is not. It's mine's a click. Yeah, mine is. And then there's your seven, and it's just going past his base. So Sick. happy with that. Superb, mate. Lovely. Couldn't be. It couldn't He's be any like closer to it. Charmed. I think, it? I, think it's, I think that's good of you to no. dice it, mate, because I don't... I think it was... Well, if you can't tell, that's the way we... This, this guy, guy spins, spins on the spot, on the doesn't spot. Oh, He's getting through his mate. So he's hitting him. <laughs> I'm not even no, going to roll. You're going to roll them both, aren't right, you? Roll the dice. See oh. if it's a one. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's a five. You're going to take five hits. Right, hang on. Oh, come on. He dies, not him. And then the, he takes five as well, though, right? No, because he didn't hit him. He died on the spot, didn't he? Oh, of course. You rolled the one and he dies anyway. Yeah. Go, this, so this guy is going to... Ooh, oh, going no. To be close. I think, yeah, yeah. Ten. He goes ten inches. So, line it up again. Yeah, again. I think, I think as much as that one, I think you'll have to dice it, Aid. I think, or maybe not. No, you, I, I think you may miss him. Four up. Yeah, four up hits him. Four up hits him. No, he doesn't hit him. Great. Superb. Okay. Are there, is he within 10 of them? No. No. He's up his butt crack. I mean, that's less abuse than that. <laughs> you can, yeah. Look, he was going. Fucking what a <laughs> cheat. What a cheat. I'm going, to, I'm going with Jeremy Direct. Right, well, he's missed it. He yeah. hasn't he? He doused it. I'm going with him. He didn't miss him. He's over here now. Ouch. What to that one? Oh, did he go that way? I think he's dead. I just probably... Oh, you just put him over there. He's one of them. He's that one. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yeah, there's no way that you've left them that close to that guy, is it? Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is magical. This is almost magical. But that's why you love fanatics, yeah. isn't it? And I think over a tournament, that's why Orcs and Goblins don't do anything. Don't do that well. Because you have one some game. games they'll do amazing, yeah. other games they'll kill you. Yeah. They've done. They've killed 75 points of themselves. <laughs> Nothing this else. This game. Nothing else. Nothing else. He's like dodged four of them. Yeah, like, yeah. Some episode of The Matrix. He's watched, he's watched one just go. Was, with the face. Like, was it Nero in The Matrix? Nero. Nero. Yeah, Nero. Go, oh, do I want to do that? The answer's no. I don't. They're going to reform. They're going to reform. And they're going to reform like that to give them as narrow a profile as they can get without taking them out of the game. <laughs> Him. There's a good chance because if they hit terrain, they die. Yeah, if they hit terrain, they die. I mean, he he's, he's close, he's isn't he? Living on borrowed time. He's on borrowed time, isn't he? Yeah, for sure. He'll go to there. Oh, could I do that? No, I can't do that. Okay. Uh, don't forget, you might want to take into account their shooting when you finish moving them because they do have a 24 inch range. Oh, they do. Okay, I'm going to. Well, they can't shoot the fanatics, they can shoot. Regular what, uh, orcs. Then what? Regular oh, and he. He's going to go, the, still in movement, he's going to move to there. And then that way he can see them. He can see him. He can't see them, but that, he doesn't need to see them anymore. That's okay. I'm hoping that they're going to do him. If they don't, we're in real trouble. Oh, no, not, because I've got great weapons. He's got before. two wounds left. He's got two wounds left, and I've got great weapons before he gets to go. So hopefully, I'll do him. Hopefully. I think he's got timber, though, hasn't he? He's yeah. a, if I don't win that roll, I'm fucked with him. <laughs> Somebody's getting sick. Yeah, but I, I, we'll see, won't we? Okay. It doesn't feel close, but it is closer because you've killed the hard hitting stuff. I think over time you win because I can't hurt you. You know, the stuff I've got. Probably that itchy scratching is probably bad for me, but let's go to bed. In fact, I'll do I'll go the full six inches. Who cares? Let's go. Let's See, now, go. I know it's me, but I'd be backing, be backing them up. Them up. I know. And that's what I thought. I thought I could march them away. Because I could just march them back to here. But and no, I'd send them up, but I'd back him off. Oh, he's worth nine on two wounds. With nine, yeah, no, because it's individual models, aid. It's individual oh, models, those units. No, it's it's Makes literally. Sense. Oh yeah, models. It, okay. In that case, yeah. So he's not worth. He's worth three. Two. Yeah, three, well, two more. Three, yeah, three. Yeah. yeah. Well, when he dies, he's worth his points. Yeah. Right. Okay. I'm gonna use conveyance on him, and I'm gonna try arcane urgency on them. Can he do it? Can he see them? Sorry. Yes, he can. Yeah. You sure? Yeah. I I couldn't see through the trees. Yes. I've turned him so that he's in his front yeah, arc. So I yes. thought he was still... No. 
for eighteen total. Not at all. Fails. God damn it. Okay, that's a shame. I don't think I'm in range now to shoot anyway. No, twenty four inches. They were loads of range. They're fine. So four shots, long range, multiple shots, hitting on sixes. Not a goddamn jelly bean. I don't even know why I bothered. Twelve points. I'll never see again. Then I'm going to cast Pillar of Fire. Seven. 11 in total. Is 11 in total. It goes off. I'll try. Ooh. Oh, I think you've already done one. You've already tried to dispel one this turn because I've rolled it on an ah. It doesn't matter. It's irrelevant. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Um, you so, didn't move closer to him. No. Either. Remains in play. Small blast template. So its central hole is within 12, but this is the one that I used the halfling cookbook on. So it's within 15 inches of the caster. It's treated as dangerous terrain. Okay. The template moves D6 in a direction of the caster's choosing during every start of turn subphase. Any unit, friend or foe, suffers two, D3 plus 3, strength 3 hits, with an AP of minus 2. Now, it doesn't say I can't put it on somebody either. Oh, no, because it bounces yeah. through, doesn't it? So yeah. I can't do that. So I'll put the template down. I'll put it down there, and I'm just going to take the central hole. Just because I'm a little bit worried about that guy. I don't want him. It's well within fifteen. Eight. Okay. I don't want him because this. Now I get it. They go at the start of turn, and you go in compulsory movement, don't you? So that's where he's going to go. Um, and then it's combat phase. There's only one combat over there. I get two d three impact hits from the Mornfang, which is only three. I'm wounding you on fives because I'm strength five. He took the six. Yep. Oh, I've caused one. Um, he's only got light armor. Yep. Yeah, and there are minus one for those. They are armor piercing, but minus one. One wound left. And then the Mourn Fang. No, it's the it doesn't it it does matter. I should do the Mourn Fang first. The Mourn Fang are four attacks each. Weapon skill three. I think the weapon skill three as well, Aid, because they are only horses. Not only horse. You're not a horse. You're a Mourn Fang. Yeah, they are weapon skill three, mate. So we're hitting you on fours. I oh, four eight. My I'm I'm so they have to take a fear check at the beginning of the combat because I'm only six. You are also six. I'm therefore not got more models than you. There's only two guys. So they have to take a fear check on an eight. An eight, they pass. They are four, eight. So therefore, they, they don't have to take it. So that's eight attacks. They're hitting on four. Okay. But statistically average aid, I love it. And then it's stroke five, tough the six, fives again. One wound. Just the one. AP? I, th I oh, I've no idea. I've got light armor only, so... so do I roll a six? No, I no. roll an arrow. Roll an arrow. <laughs> That's the one. No, it doesn't matter. Then. All right. So, timber. Timber. Four. Two. You two. Oh, thank action. God. We'll go. We'll go. We'll go. That right. way. Yeah. yeah, that way. Any way that's not my way. I don't care. Right. So I will. If you yet. Yeah, thanks so much, mate. Cheers. I'll roll to restrain with both. Okay. Well, they're going to go forward. Or the, uh, so, yeah, I get you. Yeah. Yep. Six, they pass. And the. Iron Guts, three, they pass. So, they'll reform that way. Yeah, it's a shame that you couldn't overrun to get them further away from the Fnatic, yeah, I, it? I thought what I could have done is actually, I could have re, I could have gone that way and just touched my own stuff and blocked them from yeah. doing anything, but well, I haven't, so it's irrelevant. So, we check now to see breaking points. Turn four, isn't it? Yes, turn four, and it's start of turn so, four. At the moment, I have got one, two, three. Uh, 19 makes 22, 22, 32, 36. You've got 36. I've got 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 21, 25, 29. Okay. I can see the game ending this turn. Yeah. Because I'm going to see how the Fanatics do. Yeah. Because these can't take the rest of your army. That, I mean, that's valid. So at the start of turn, I'll D6 that. Now... That's at the start of the turn. Start of the turn, that is, yeah. It's it moves four inches. I'll, I'll move choose it. the direction. Yeah, and I'll choose the direction. So I'll do that. Okay. So it touches him and it does D three plus three strength three hits. It might be worth oh. holding. Okay. So it takes five is um, it dangerous terrain. Yeah, it is it counts as dangerous terrain, yes. If he hits any kind of terrain, he dies. Is it when he hits the terrain though? Okay, we'll we'll do it this way because yeah. I think he's going to die anyway. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. He's toughness three, right? Yep, toughness three. 
Yeah, well, there's he's yeah. he's he's well dead. He's well dead. So okay, then it's the, your start of turn phase. Okay, I think because he's got itchy nuisance on him, might be worth me charging. Oh, has he? I forgot about that. Oh no, it wouldn't matter because I can't do. I probably could have. I should have used my fated dispel to dispel that. What I should have done. It's fine. I haven't done it. Can you do it now? No, it's during your. It's during my own turn. I can okay. dispel one spell. Right. Okay. So I will try. I have no characters other than the ones that are in the unit. Itchy nuisance is already running. I'm, I'll just double check. Itchy nuisance is remains in play because if it's not, I will have to cast it again. Yeah. And yeah. You yeah. Will have the opportunity. I oh, know. No, until the start of your next turn. Oh, Mork's Curse, which is the other one, is the um, the re-rolling armor saves. And that six, remains in play. Which would be quite powerful against you, because yeah, you only have an armor saver. Yeah. Crappy armor. So I am going to try and cast it then, Andy. I need a nine on him. Cool. So I get... Seven. Ten in total. I'll try and dispel it. And you might be within your range. No, because you haven't moved, and I don't think I have either aid. There's 27 there. Right, that's the code. That's the edge. So no, no, any. Oh God. Okay, I need. To, if I'd have done that, I could have pushed him forward in that last turn to put me in that twenty-seven. Yeah. Important. Um. So I need an eleven. Yes. I need them. No. Goes off. Itchy nuisance on him. Okay. Which is D three. D. Yeah. Minus you only rolled a one. To last time, toughness. To toughness. And initiative. Oh, cool. Okay. I mean, do I roll separately for both? No, I think it's toughness and initiative. Eh? Yeah. Exactly the same as last time. Okay. Now I do that before we declare charges, don't we? Cause... Yes, indeed. Right. I know what's going to happen. If I charge him, he'll come this way and <laughs> you. I feel I've got a charger. A hundred percent. So these are going to attempt to charge him. I'll hold. Um. These can't. No, nope, they can't see him. They will just. You're right. They will just stay where they are. So, uh, well, I don't need to declare that yet. Nope. These are charging. Yep. You're holding. I take the they're highest. Co- they're correct. They've made that, haven't they? Five and four is nine inch charge, isn't it? Yeah, easy. So I will maximise. Oh. I will attempt to net you when it comes to combat. Yes, because it's minus one to my strength, isn't it? Unless I roll a one, then it's minus, minus one, one to my strength. strength. Cool. <laughs> they are fun to play with, but you've yeah. got to have a sense of humour about yeah. it. Yeah. Because they you could, could be really you frustrated about that, couldn't you? Yeah. Away. I don't know where I've rolled That's that one. Four inches. Oh, I thought it was a double. That would be an ace. So mental. Whee! Uh, this guy. Yeah. Again, well, irrelevant. Unless he rolls a double. He hasn't. Five, Five inches. inches. Happy with that? Yep. Perfect, Dave. Lovely. He's nicely moved out of your way. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe make a charge. So, um, no that's that. Could movement phase. Enchantment. I didn't do it. Do it. Do it. Okay, Just thank you, it. Andy. It's a self one yeah. on a nine. It goes off on a ten. Oh, 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 it moved closer. I'm within 27. There's my 27 is there, right? Yeah. It so range? Can. Oh, six. So 10 you rolled. Six, yes. 10, yeah. Seven plus four is 11. Yep. Woo, he stops it. That's the first think, time I've ever dispelled a spell. I think that's the first time a spell's ever been dispelled. Thanks. We've had them not go off. Yeah. The, the hex, Um, I will try... Now, hexes were already a conveyance. No. So that's it. If you want to do your hex, you can do it. Again. No, I did it. Okay. Oh, you well, did it? I did that hex. That hex is D3 to your minus to your weapon skill. Go for it. Do it then. Are you, you sure? Yeah, you'd have done it on him anyway, wouldn't you? And you'd have done it before you... Wait. You'd, you'd have done that before you moved. Yeah. So, so both of those spells go off then. Are you sure? Yes, because you've done it, you'd have done it before you moved. Well, I'll try and get this one off. Yeah, go for it. It goes off. Yes. So both go off. What was the first... What did that first one do? Um, sorry. That... Sorry. I don't know why that's... That there. one's there because he's got minus one toughness. Okay. It's what does he... three. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> I can roll yeah. I can calculate. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this one is D3 to his weapon skill and initiative. Okay. Two. So... He's initiative one. That's the lowest. He's initiative one. He's initiative one anyway, so that's so, fine. Yeah. And he's so weapon he's... skill one. As weapon skill one, initiative one, toughness two, toughness three. Okay. What was the other spell that I just dispelled? What was that one? That was the re-rolling ones so, to hit you. At okay. AP minus one. So you're re-rolling ones to hit me as well. Oh, okay. Because you'd have cast that before, before you did. moved, and I wouldn't have been able to dispel it. You sure? Yes. Of course. Of course. Right. So it's he's fucking in trouble, that guy. Well, it's going to be four guys. If I I'll you, issue a challenge, I'll, yes. Yeah. I will refuse. Yeah, I'll refuse. Now you choose who goes back. What? 
But I can't attack him anyway. No. Right, well, I'll send the champion then for sure. So it's just four attacks instead of five. Yeah. I will well, try and this first. Yeah, fine. So I'm strength two, strength three, toughness three, initiative and weapon skill one. Okay. So my guys will go first. Oh, no, it's minus one. Weapon skill two. Lies to you. So four, I do, it's three normal guys and the wizard, because the wizard might be better, he might be worse. Oh, okay. He's probably got a higher initiative. No. But I reckon he'll have three attacks. For a wizard? Wizard lord, though, isn't he? And wizard lords are good. They have to be slightly better anyway. Odd knob, he's called. Oh, it's an odd knob, I love him. Two attacks. Oh, okay. So but I bet he's the he same, is initiative right? four. Weapon skill four. So he's hitting me on threes because I'm weapon skill three. Two hits. Weapon skill two, even. Strength three. Toughness three, so fours. One one wound. Minus one AP because of your yeah. shenanigans. So that gives me a six upset. No. Takes another wound. And then the other guys. The other three lads. Nothing. Oh, really, goblins? Roll up your sleeves, big chap. I might have been better accepting the challenge, haven't I? So he gets, he's still got five attacks, but he's only weapon skill two. Your weapon skill two. No, weapon skill three. He took two off whatever you were. Down oh, to a minimum two of off. one. So it's one then, I'm yeah. weapon skill one. So you're hitting me on fives. Because you never hit on sixes, do you? I'm Sixes? I thought you only no, hit on fives. I think I'm, in, I'm looking to see what weapon, weapon skill, skill I am. Because I think I'm only two. Oh. In which case you're hitting me on fours. Fours. No, yeah, no, it's still fives, isn't it? Because I'm worse. Oh, no. It's double if it's double plus one, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. I mean, roll, Andy, it might not matter. Yeah, it might not matter. It might not matter. It, 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 I rolled a five, eight, so I, I will hit you and lots of misses. Right, hang on. Uh, oh, so you've got no fours. No, got no fours anyway. Okay, yeah. And I've rolled a five as well. He's only strength three, your toughness three. You're still AP two, though, aren't you? No, wait, no, no AP on them. No AP. Oh, I thought no you were saying. No, no AP. Just a guy. Just saved it as well. Right, so you've got a wound, a banner, two rank. No, one rank. Yes. Wound, banner, one rank is three. I've done nothing, so I'm at minus three, putting me at leadership four. Okay. Because we're both close order, so yeah, four. Double one. Double one. This I guy, will take it. This guy needs a name. He needs a name. Jeez. So you go back to each is Which, I mean, that would have been horrendous as well, wouldn't it, if I had done that? And those curses until the start of my next turn. Start of your next yeah. turn. I okay. will try and restrain on a seven. I don't think you have to. Because I've passed my leadership test. You can either stay or go. Oh, I'll stay there. You don't have to. So I'll do two inches away then, Abe. Let me go two inches away. That should be two inches, shouldn't it? That bit. Oh, yeah. There you go. Line port. Oh, but it's yeah. slightly less because you're bait, because you're, you're what's it, right? Uh, but that's, I mean, I don't know why I've put that on him, but I'll leave it there anyway. And that's my turn. Cool. So, start of turn. Right, don't forget, things to remember. Yeah. Your stupidity, your cauldron, moving him. Mind you, he's in range now. Yeah, and this. Yes. So, start of turn, I'll do this. It's going to go that way. Do you declare charges? No. No, because no, it's start of turn phase, isn't it? Isn't yeah, you, you roll, don't you, to see how far? Yeah, I agree. Oh, no, because it's only D6 inches. Just yeah, I mean, You can choose to end it, can't you? Just, yeah, you're right, I could. I'm just wondering. That's a, that's a 10. I reckon I can get that. I'm going to end that. I'll let that fall. I mean, that's an 11. But you got six to start, haven't you? Yeah, you got six to start. So it's a five. All right. Well, all right. Right. Charges, then. Stupidity first. Stupidity, thank Golden you. And then your spells. So, stupidity on him. <laughs> yeah. And the spells, Andrew. <laughs> Nine fails. So he goes into the woods. Into yeah, they the just woods. stumble forward. Into then. the woods, my love. Because it doesn't stop you casting. No, you can still cast. No, it's charges. Yes, charges now. No, no spells first. Yes. Oh, he's not even... He's not, they're not in, though. That's the only thing. That would be that would have been great. Right, so let's go with target. No, on a three. Oh, three and four is seven. It does go off. Well, I'll try and stop of that. Of course you will. Double one. Let's go. Miscast on your wizard. Seven. Uh, seven. Seven's okay. Seven's Isn't okay. That what you had? No, you had a five. No, you? I had a five. Yeah. Miss. Oh, it's on the front. It's on the very front. Yeah. What are all seven? Seven. Careless conjuration. The wizard mispronounces a syllable, causing the spell to backfire, knocking them to the ground. The wizard suffers a single strength four hit with an AP of minus oh, one. Oh, living the dream. So uh, force. Force to wound him. 
just cause him a wound. He has no armor. He's got no armor save. He's taking his second wound. Yep. Oh, this could be very interesting. This could aid. So, charging charges then. They're going to charge them. Yeah, they'll hold. He's going to charge them. They'll They're going to charge them. They'll hold all the way through. Holding all the way through. Oh, great. Let's go. Um, so, his charge is going to be automatic, yes? Yes. He's going to go over to... That, how many do you have to get? Four? No, because they're coming as well. Yeah. You only have to maximise. So maximise is three, isn't it? There you go. So if I do that, that's yeah. three, isn't it? Sick one. Because you've got a 40 and I'm on 25, so yeah. the most you can do... He's moved two inches, hasn't he? That's yeah. all he's moved. I mean, it, don't get me wrong. He's only initiative three. You still hit me first. These guys, they need a five. Yeah, because they were 11 inches away. So they need a five on one dice. Or a four. Oh, shit. So they stop an inch away. An inch away, don't they? Oh, is that okay? Yeah, yeah. Happy with that? yeah. And then these guys need tens. So two dice. That's a six. It's 50 50. It's 50 50. Oh, is that three? I can't see it. I can see it. So is that an inch? That's an inch away. <laughs> oh, lads. So there. Yeah. So then it's compulsories. Oh, God, this is going to work. Like, no, it spins and prints. Spins on the spot. Just, hang on, just do the double. oh, yeah, doubles, yeah. He's dead. Super. <laughs> Living the dream. Living the dream. And then the wee fella over here. Matt's in for a kicking because I'm never going to roll doubles against him. There's, a, there's another one. That's 100 points I've just made myself there. 100 points. Remaining moves. Get on with it, lads. Thank you. Right. You've charged me, so you get to issue the challenge first. I've charged you, so I get to do an impact it first. Well, you issue the challenge and that's who it goes on. Oh, okay. But you get overkill. I'll issue your challenge. I will take it with my champion. With you with your champion, that's perfectly reasonable. So, yeah, you'll probably kill him with the impact, but you get to do all the rest as well. So, but he's only... Oh, no, so when the nets come in? Straight away. So do your nets first, then? Yep, yep, just... So he's strength three, toughness three is a four plus. Oh, bastard. Yep, cause the wound, no AP. Five uh, up, I'm saving it. So five up, yeah. Saves, it's hiding behind his shield. Swine. Clang. No, I'm initiative three because I've charged two inches. Um, I'm initiative three as well. So we're hitting each other at the same time. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. I think um, you're still I'm low still weapon one, skill. So I'm hitting you on fours or fives. It makes literally no difference because I've rolled sixes and twos. Yeah, they're both until the start of my next Cool. Turn, so. And I'm wounding you on fours because I'm strength four, you're tough, so I'm strength three, you're toughness three. Yeah. Two wounds, aid. Come on, fella. No, no, double. So that's two wounds I've caused. So two In, wounds. Yeah, two wounds to the combat res. Uh, he gets to fight back. Yep. Weapon skill two. Your weapon skill one, aren't you? Yeah, so threes. So threes. One. And I'm toughness three. Your strength three. three. So fours. One wound. Uh oh, don't die. It's okay. He lives. Uh, oh, he lives. No one else can fight because of the no challenge. No one can fight because of the challenge. You've got a rank and a banner. I've got two wounds, which means it's a draw. And you haven't got a position, have you? No. So it's a no. drawn combat. So we just stand where we are and look pretty. Yeah. Well, that was nice. I'll take it. I'll super take that. When, when one guy can almost kill. Yeah. All of them. Um, so, no, you killed him. You killed my guy. He's killed your champion. Right. So I no longer have a champion. A champion, here. correct. So next time you wish you would... I mean, I won't. You won't accept. Of course you won't. Um, so that's that falls off me now. So everything falls off and that guy's back I up to his that fully I should have my job money on one wound. Yes. Whether it oh, would have been worth I wouldn't taking have done. it. He's toughness four, though, isn't he? No, so but... he needed fives to wound you, but I rolled two fives, so he yeah. would be dead. Yeah. And he got, Although, he got the armor. But your weapon skill is double plus one. Your weapon skill is four, isn't it? So I'd have needed mm. fives to you, but I rolled three sixes and two twos. Yeah. So I'd have hit you, and so I would have He'd killed you. He'd, He'd, He'd be dead. dead. You would have been dead. Yeah. So that's the end of turn four. That is the end of turn four. It's turn five. Kink. What you gonna do? I, I think it's pretty much over, but I will go through the motions. Up to you, Aid. Again, I'm happy because to call it where we are if you want to. Well, all I say... The nice thing is he's tied them for a turn. Yeah. The only thing you can do charge is them charge in, like, them in. And they'll do... I don't think okay, it's a great idea. Let's say I kill both. Yeah. It doesn't matter because they can do them. Yeah, they... Because they've got four attacks each. He's got five with a great weapon. Yeah. I think as soon as you kill him, their leadership drops. Oh, yeah. Down to five, six. Well, it's their leadership four. four normally, to I five. Think five. Yeah. In trouble, aren't you? You're in trouble then. So I, I, we could go through the motion. Yeah, right. yeah happy to. Happy nice to one, Ellie. Thanks, mate. Cheers. Closer than I thought. Oh, yeah. I, I was. I when, was... when you got hold of the mangler squig, I thought, 
Uh-oh. It's going to be one way traffic. This the is. only thing that I probably should have done was I don't know whether I don't think I should have taken. I think taking the charge from a giant is a really big mistake. So I think moving the Mourn Fang on yeah. was right. But the fact it then took them another turn to turn around and then another turn to come back again to do anything. Yeah, I but they killed a giant, so yeah. and uh, and they definitely saved that unit because otherwise I'd be another six wound at uh, six points down. Yeah. It depends if I roll Edbutt, you take a wound. I take a wound and nobody cares. But likewise, many flop they're yeah. dead, aren't they? Yeah. Um I I don't think there was decisions, but I don't think there was a, a right or a wrong. Yeah. It was yeah. just well, I think these, I think they are enough to do them and these are enough to do them. Oh, I think on the impact hits, if I roll average, where I kill four of them yeah. before we even start, yeah. and then if they cause one more wound, I mean, I'd probably issue a challenge. So the champion would take, take it, it, but then because the next if round... If I didn't, you would issue a yeah. challenge. And then the next round, everything goes on here. Yeah. My, I mean, don't get me wrong, my heroes are 30 points. Yeah, you don't care, die. do you? But it, yeah. it's more of a leadership buff for them, isn't he it? He's there to give them plus one leadership. Yeah. And at 30 points, no problem. Happy to do that. But, I mean, it's turn five. I don't think we've had many games go this far. No, not it's, at all. We've normally called them before. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, oh, so... Um, I, I, I mean, this. <laughs> look, one inch. Yeah. One inch. What surprised me was how hard oh, the goblins The, the hoppers do. The hoppers they are do amazing. Melt. They do melt. Yeah. I like them. I do no like armor them. save I get because I've only got five up armor saves on my stuff anyway. Yeah. But having having more, you're going to have no armor. Yeah. None. I think um, maybe the Fanatics mistimed. Yeah, maybe I, a... They were, I think I was too far. I think you had a really unlucky um, go bang save, oh, whatever that's called. And it just called yeah. Flee through your through those, and then they were well back. But that's the risk, I think, because you know, if you roll a double, it's going to go back. Yeah, and you know you're going to cast, well, a level four, ideally four spells a turn. So yeah, you are going to a it's one, about six, one in six, six isn't it? Yeah, yeah. you in are going to roll. You're going to roll a double, aren't you? Um, you just hope that it's later. But then, really, you only. Sh- I mean, you did that. Middle of turn three? Yeah. So if you're casting four spells a turn, you're actually probably looking it for it to go over yeah. turn two. I've got no complaints about it. I. It's a shame you can't just use it in certain occasions. You have to you use have it You have to use time. it every time. Yeah, you wouldn't go, actually, I'll use the banger stick to cast this one, yeah. and then you only do it on those you put. But that's yeah. probably why they do it like that. Well, it's, but that's the orcs, and I think if ever I'm playing this army, it is about having fun. Yeah. Yeah. You're not taking this to a tournament, yeah. are you? No. Because they're, they're too if unpredictable. It all, if it all goes your way, then great. I mean, something I totally forgot and people will be shouting at is the impetuous rule. Oh, okay. Um, which would have affected the night goblins. Right. Because... Is it a leadership check or they have to go forward? Yeah. Oh, or, okay. or it's charge. <laughs> okay. But I think the only time I... Could have charged. I did. Oh yes, because they were too far back anyway, yeah. and you've only got. But here, each charge, haven't you? Here, these would, I would roll to see. Otherwise, they would have to charge. Yeah. But the the reason you we've never come across it before is because I've always had black oaks. Yes, and black oaks and have black that oaks aura. On impetuous. Um, I I'm mixed about the fanatics. I think you know if it goes your way, you're going to annihilate. Yeah, your enemy. I think that like I think that now. In the old game, and we said that we're not going to do this a lot, but in the old yeah. game, when you charge them, you could release the fanatics into a charge. Yeah. And that meant you could hold them, hold them, hold them, hold yeah. them. And when your opponent charges you, you go. But it used to be when if they ended in the inside a unit, yeah. they died, but they yeah. took yeah, it was double the hits them. or something like that. Yeah. But well, I can decide whether they get triggered or not as well. Yes, then. exactly. And I think. If, like you said, I was coming towards you anyway, if you hadn't have had that flee backwards and then you're out of the game, I wonder whether or not you release them either a turn late or a turn early. Yeah. Because you know my stuff eventually has to come and get you. Yeah. You're probably better off holding those fanatics until I'm eight, ten inches away from you. I, I suppose if I've got a unit of 35 yeah. with the stubborn banner, yeah, I know I can take a charge. Yeah. So you hit me, I take the charge, then I release it. And you release it. And I know I'm rolling into you. Unless I'm rolling doubles, they're hitting that unit. Yeah. And three fanatics, I mean, that's 10 on average. Yes. Strength five hits. Strength five hits. That will shred that unit. Yeah. 
So and maybe at minus that's... three AP as well, you're getting very yeah. in the way of armor. Maybe that's an experiment to be done. Yeah. But I wanted to go Night Goblins today. I think as an army, they work really well. Yeah. I genuinely do. I think that possibly the giant is a little bit weak in this. Although, the fucking mental damage, Yeah. I, like, that was because he rolled Situation belly flop. Yeah. Belly flop's great, but against ogres, because they're too big, he doesn't get the really meaty. Yeah. Pick people up and smash units with their own men. That said, though, if there had been a unit of 20 high elves yeah. with belly flop, yeah, you're killing half of them. Yeah, that's oh, of course, because it's actually the template, then, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, you're getting four or five definite hits. Yeah. At strength six, you're wounding that on two. Yeah. The only thing that yeah. had a massive impact was the staff of Badoom. Yeah, but I'm still undecided whether or not to take it. I will take it every so game. Fun. I will take it. Uh, the thing is, I was looking at it thinking, is that like, what were the mushrooms? What do the mushrooms do? Mushrooms are immune to psychology. Oh, uh, okay. Just, Never because they were never in the fight. Immune psychology is irrelevant. Um, but I think maybe he doesn't go in the unit. Yeah. He well, sits outside knowing the staff of Badoon's gonna go off. Yeah. And then he takes a wound. Who cares? Yeah, it's fine that. As long as he's two and a half inches away from everyone else. I guess the only thing you've got to be worried about is there's no leader in that unit then. And if they take a morale check, they yeah. go. But you don't care because it's a unit of night goblins, I guess. And if it, there's a general nearby, they can use his leadership, use leadership anyway. rather than the war band. They yeah. have a choice, don't they? So, yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a thought process to be had. I really enjoyed it. I love him playing the orcs and goblins. I think they're a great deal of fun. And uh, just the fact that they're a beautiful, beautiful painted army as well. They look great. The, um, around. It, it's consistency of colours. that and they look it, great. Yeah. As long as you don't look too close. And then all you need to do, are you gonna are you gonna do anything with movement trades? Are you just leave them white. What are you doing with them? I'm tempted because I've done it with the well, you've seen that me do one. it here. Yeah. Earth. But it comes off the magnets. Oh, does it? So I think what I need can to do. Can you seal it? Well, I'm thinking about a can yeah. might stick to it better. So if I get Oh, you just spray. painted that over. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that I did the base, had some left over and just I painted just, just it. Did the bit, yeah, as an experiment. But, but you can see even just putting them on and off the magnets, yeah. drags it. Um, so yeah, I I will mm. probably print some more off and spray can them. just spray can Hopefully it'll stick to them. If I'd have primed them, it might have stuck yeah, better. Yeah, yeah. Because I'm, I'm thinking, obviously because you know me, I like black rimmed bases. I'm thinking I'm just going to spray mine black. Yeah. And then, and hopefully, because it's primer, it's a little bit more hard wearing. Yeah. Maybe, because mine will be black, if it rubs off of the magnet strip, you don't you'll never see it anyway, will you? Yeah. I'll have, I'll have an experimentation. But like I say, even if, it's only because I was too lazy to go out. <laughs> you know, sometimes you'll pour the paint. Yeah. And you just because I still use the Valero Earth that I was using fifteen oh, years yeah. ago. Well, I'm still using as much as I can the same paints that I yeah. use. Still using Bane Blade Brown. But I really, it. really enjoyed that. That was great fun. It's good to be back. It's great to be back. It's great to be back. Hopefully, you've enjoyed the battle report. Yeah, Aiden I will edit it so a lot of the stuff all that we've, uh, mistakes we've made. We've made a lot of mistakes, kids. Just in case you're thinking, oh, they're so yeah. polished. No, Aid's editing skills are polished. None of this. It's, it's um. It's definitely wargaming for fun. I don't know what so. time we started. I've no idea. But I got here for about half one-ish. Yeah. It's now 20 past seven. So we've been going for 56 hours. So and whatever Aid's yeah. done. Yeah. Enjoy this 45 minutes back and the 100 hours editing I did of cutting out the ums and ahs. Uh, Essentially, if I don't edit it, you will be watching me and Andy. It will be like being in a book club. I mean, literally, you will see my arse for a lot of this time, <laughs> me doing this. That's all. I didn't even think about it whilst I was being filmed. You just see my arse. More OnlyFans than YouTube, <laughs> isn't it? So, yeah, if you would like to watch me and Andy read, yeah, in silence. Own, you can join our Patreon where you get to see us read in silence. <laughs> don't do it, kids. Yeah, that would be true if we if had a Patreon, Patreon. But we don't. We don't have one of them. No, 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 no Enjoy no, no. the show. Enjoy the show. But, and we'll catch you probably in another two weeks. Yeah. We're... And if you watch back in the day, say hi. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Those fans to Warren, to Dan. Warren. Warren. A lot of these, oh, well, you won't see them, oh. You oh. will see them in time, Warren. Yeah, your Black Orcs and your Boar Boys that you bought for Age of Sigmar, which when you packed that in, you gave us, are Legend. painted and ready to They're go. They're painted and ready to go. Aid's got all yeah. your Orcs ready to rock yeah. and roll. Um, Dan, Scott. Yeah. Me, Skibbo. Good to see you, gentlemen. Thanks for watching. Yes. And we'll see, see you all. all. I mean, we had, eventually, well, people. our plan, and I might put this at the beginning of the Yes, that's a good idea. Because no one's going to watch this lot. Yeah.
But our plan, once we're up and running and we've got decent terrain and we're making hobby vids and all that again, is to start getting people ready to come and play us yeah. like we used to. And you know, that we will probably to... start with our close yeah. friends that we've got in town. Yeah. So Matty and Paul will yeah. probably come down and play some games with yeah. us to start off with. And then we'll branch that out into the uh, wider U lot community. And I, I think the reason we stopped doing that, I mean, I'm talking 10 years ago now. Oh, yeah, yeah. But the reason we stopped doing that was because the people who came kept coming back. Yeah. And we never wanted to say no. Yeah, and we never needed any new friends, did we? We had a really yeah. good circle of maybe so 10 people. We had a good people play. who knew the game inside out, had painted armies, had the right attitude and to play in our game, yeah. Social skills and all the rest. Perfect partners to play against. So if you think you've got what it takes to yeah. be shit at this game, but enjoy doing it while you're playing, <laughs> if you know, fantastic, <laughs> come and play us, because you'll be right at home. If you think breaking theme on a list is trying too hard, welcome. Yes, welcome. You're welcome. all welcome to our shed, garage. You're welcome. Yeah. Oh, it's been fun. Guys, thanks for watching us. We appreciate you as always. See you next time.